Right, I think we're back. I think we're alive. Possibly. Can we get, can we get an F in the chat for my Wi-Fi adapter there for a minute? <laughs> just also to just show that I've reconnected. So I thought that was my entire internet going down. Uh, which I kind of expected because we had an issue with that a couple of days ago. Because of course I did. But I like, no, it looks it looks like my Wi-Fi adapter just decided to give up the ghost. Uh, I, I did the old turn it off and on again. So I'm just realising uh, probably going to have to resend the link out. This is going to take a moment, hey. Tell you what, I'll... Uh... We should have people start to come back in now. Slowly. Eventually. Oh well. I knew there was going to be something. I couldn't go all day without an issue. Liam's alive. Give us a uh, give us a minute, and I'll be uh, we'll be we'll be back in, and we'll we'll discover the fate of George. Just need to uh, to make sure people see the stream. Cat, yeah, I put I've, I had to very quickly make a technical issues thing just before the stream. Uh, so I'm like, lucky I did that, because I was like, there's going to be an issue at some point. So I was like, what what have I got that I can use for, like, technical issues? And that's a worried-looking cat. That'll do. Shall we? Shall we get back to the the ch children kidnapping 
extravaganza. You didn't, you didn't miss much. The uh, the German doctor fella basically just explained what these are, which is uh, artificial blood. That, that's it. Like you really didn't miss much. Ooh. Aren't you impressed by the 2013 destruction engine? Right. Let's 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 get. Let's, let's have a seat. in smaller doses but breathe too much of it George is duplicated there's now more of them break that glass and I'll blow his brains out break the glass break it surrender or decide the needs of the many or the needs of the few let me assure you, the needs of the few outweigh the needs of George. Surrender. I won't ask again. Well, you're not wrong. George broke the stream. That is what happened. Are you sure? Do it. I'm ready. Me life no so precious. That's the first smart thing you've said. To hell with me. Literally, Stop this it. is why Raiden is my no. hero. I'll kill him, I swear. Yeah. Like, here's the thing. There's room. Like, there's space here. Raiden could have gone for the head, but no, he goes for the body. <laughs> George as well. He intentionally kills George. He does it on purpose. I'm sure of it. I know what it's trying to say. It's like, in order to hit the doctor, he had to kill George. But, like, sadly not. It, it, just, it just looks like it, it just gone straight for it. So here's why I didn't mind buying the uh, the commando uniform, because now we unlock the mariachi uniform. Do 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 we do we go for the mariachi uniform? All I'm saying, it's pretty pretty sleek. That's <laughs> only 20,000. Baby puke green. You really like the baby puke green. I, I'll tell you what, you can, you can argue in the, in the chat I'm going to do the upgrades and... I might not actually have enough money to, to do the mariachi uniform after all this anyway, so... Oh... <laughs> yeah, it's not looking likely. I won't lie. Oh no! If, if fuel cells are the same. 10,000. Can... So we can either have... Like, a really good aerial attack. Or a mariachi uniform. Now, to me, the answer is simple. But I, I, I'm the fact that Bernard is just 
like shouting baby puke green repeatedly makes me believe that we should just stick with 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 green so i'm gonna gonna get that ability i bet i will never remember to use it either Like, now that the stream's come back online, 90% of the chat is baby puke green. Moss green. Four, I mean five, I mean cyborg. So do you, do you want some really, really bad news? President Hamilton is on his way to the Middle East this morning for his scheduled visit with Pakistani President Farooq Salam. That's not the bad news. The meeting is viewed as an attempt by the U.S. to strengthen relations amidst a surge of anti-American sentiment in the this region. This is the bad news. Yo, me ninja brother! George, good to see you up in the back. How you feeling? Never better, nah? No pain, no more star while them hunger space eat, and me never ever feel so awake, nah? That's because your blood sugar levels are being maintained automatically. Beats the hell out of coffee. Oh! We've been here you go while I got them scone in the base. Why do Rasa you not take me with you, huh? Damn it, Doc. Sorry, kid. You'd just be in the way. Aww. Besides, I thought you didn't want to be a killer, right? Me don't, but... Killing isn't fun in games. Remember that. Right. Right, now I believe that's the last we see of George for most of the game. <laughs> okay? I think that's, that's all, I think that's all we have to deal with. that they made it clear that the police are part of a private military corporation. Otherwise, there might be some moral ambiguity to what's happening right now. Private, what is this Gamnia? You cannot resign! Sorry, Boris, it's done. Can't have a Maverick employee involved in a corporate raiding now, can we? You could at least come talk to me. No. It was time to break away from the old team, Boris. Past time. You cannot take on Marshall all by yourself. I won't sit by while they butcher little kids and ship their parts around like meat. It's sick. It's not all so simple, right? They import those brains legally. For medical purposes, it's all done. Being legal doesn't make it right. Right, I... They import those child brains legally. <laughs> Yep, that's America. Oh yeah, Blade Wolf's here as well. I think I forgot to mention, his name is Blade Wolf. Blade Wolf. I feel like I don't need to explain further. going to get topical in a second. Seriously, why the high heels? I don't know. What? I will patrol ahead. Not just high heels, but like high heels that are ribbed for her pleasure. Hey, it's... Guess you better arrest me then. Right, he's giving up. <laughs> He did to you. 18 3104.7, threatening a peace officer. Deadly force is authorized. They put away their guns to get out of their batons. Come on, this is gonna. 
Oh no. Oh dear. Oh, oh no. Oh my. Oh no. Oh. Yeah, they send the weakest enemies <laughs> in the game. Just to. Shot me with a rocket launcher. Get off. It's giving me a hug. Uh, I need health. Give me health. Cook them. I mean. Honestly, at this point, uh, like, he is kind of eating their spines. The rest is just going to waste. He no longer has arms. So he's just going to kick me. You're just going to... Hey, I know my audience, i.e. It's just, it's just the guys from the ladder. Where's he? He's not. He's just crushing them and absorbing their electrolytes. The, the, the game knows, the game knows what it is. It's not, it's not pretending. Um, it's even more not pretending when uh, you do this. Yes, Tovarich. Act, act, this is this is an actual video game that you can buy. You've just lost the game. Uh, we're just gonna quietly move on. So these guys, if you parry them enough, they eventually lose the parrying and just just give up. But if 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 you're impressive enough, they just go, you know what, just kill me. That's fine. I'm still getting bees. The road is blocked by barricades. We will proceed point. through the buildings. You will follow me. That's a point. So, it, 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 Metal Gear is known for its like codec calls that you can do. You can just give people a ring and see how they're doing. You can do that in this game. You you can just call Wolf. Your earlier actions were reckless, Raiden. Not to mention the damage to a perfectly good car. I knew the risks when I decided to go through with this. Besides, the car was mine. Maverick sold it to me. It's not meant for private use. It was made for ops like this. Regardless, your approach has proven most antagonistic. You are now a criminal, a public enemy, a police-killing vigilante. Even if your actions reveal World Marshal's designs, you will be unable to avoid legal punishment. Probably not. But that's a price I'll have to pay. I gotta stop that VR program and get those kids back. I sealed my fate the second I attacked George. But George is not dead. 
unfortunately. He has obtained an even more versatile body than his previous one. Oh god, we've I'm made him more powerful. <laughs> I'm talking what about have we me. done? I was a child soldier in Liberia. Like 410 billion dead I was dead a mentally cops. deranged child. People feared me. Called me Jack the Ripper. A Born to die. So Life Sears is a fuck. Program. I thought I'd left it all in the past. But just like that, I am trash, Jack man. came roaring back. This is why you are so driven to terminate the VR training? I... I understand. I will continue to cooperate. Copy that. So, you can if eventually get more. I think that currently because of the story stuff, I don't actually work for Maverick at the minute, so I can't call, like, Kev or anything like that. Even though they are clearly still in contact with me. Yeah, they'll, they'll tell you various things, but you might know, those conversations are a bit long-winded, so I just don't bother. I want to want to cut up robots. Uh, there does not appear to be uh, any chance of Dino Crisis. If you mean on the stream, no, because <laughs> again. It's only on the PS1, and I am not setting up an emulator just to play Dino Crisis. Um, there, I do know a website that you can play it on your browser, but that's setting up more stream stuff, and I can't be bothered. So. Filthy casual. What do you want from me? Like, not even Capcom cares about Dino Crisis. You can't force me to give a damn. I mean, don't get me wrong. Bring back Dino Crisis. It's the coolest, but, like... I don't, I don't have time to set that up for a stream. HQ. Requesting the zone be designated for heightened security. Roger. Upgrading security status. Are you gonna walk out from under there? Cool. So I can't... Uh, the, the, uh, the How I've positioned the chat on my screen it makes it a little bit difficult to, uh, to see the map. So this could be interesting. His arm, though. Step. has been plotted based on data culled from various security systems. I took the liberty of adding a guidance device to your chassis to ensure you do not stray too far. And eh? Oh no. <laughs> I'm genuinely curious to see if I can do this mission, or at least this bit of the mission, with some level of stealth. is on your soliton radar. I think that actually counted. Wish, it is your choice. Somehow, that was a complete stealth win. <laughs> Bonus fights. Here comes more of them.
Call me a filthy casual. I've just got a no damage S rank. Fight me. I swear I'm good at video games. Probably. It's the only thing I've got. Crashed my car. I'll have to go the rest of the way on foot. <laughs> That's one way you'll really have to do this. I can't believe they ruined I'm my fed car. Up with all of it. Companies like ours, yours, bend the laws when it suits business. Why not bend it when it can save innocent lives? Right in. Boris, She's listen to me. Push this that VR training. They'll be warped into killing machines. They'll be set on POWs, civilians. It'll be one atrocity after another. Hmm. Like what you went through. We can't have any more Jack the Rippers. You saw what happened with George. I'm doing this, Boris. I have to. I can't save those kids from becoming cyborgs, but I can stop them from becoming murderers. So you succeed. So you get all the brains back. Then what? Just so happens I know a great cybernetic surgeon. Doctor, but he cannot. You won't change my mind, Boris. This is my fight now. And your wife and son? What of them? Oh yeah, forgot They're about in them. New Zealand. Safe. <laughs> Rose would understand why I have to do this. <sighs> All right, damn you. You do realize Marshall has the contract for law enforcement throughout the city. They are the law in Denver. Yeah. We re right. really got to well, hammer that home. We are not <laughs> killing Officially, police officers. Maverick Incorporated condemns you and your actions as unlawful. And a pain in the asshole. Now. Increase your codec encryption. Do not worry about the lag. And unofficially? I'll do all I can over the codec to help. I do not like what those mudaki are doing any more than you. Spasiva, Tavarish. Spasiva. So, again... Yes, Tavarish. Game knows what it is. Um, I don't know. Let's move on. Police cows. From now on, I am vegan, and this is bat cow. Please stop. Oh, no. Ah, oh, thank God. You're making a reference, so I'm not getting it. Another box, add it to the list. Yeah, but it is a sword wielded by a robot. Also, they explain it by it being a high frequency, uh, high frequency blade, which uh, you can find vibrates so it can cut through things like a chainsaw. Even though there are actual chainsaws in this game. And, and a sword that's actually a chainsaw would be cool as hell, but I guess not. But yeah, I, I mean, I get, like, it's like, hey, why do you 
use swords in Final Fantasy. It's that luck as you can shoot a fireball from your hand. You really don't need a gun, do you? Having a sword which is just an arm. Huh. No, there's a rumor the MIBs come from Area 51. <laughs> I mean, can you imagine if, like, one of the bosses and their, uh, okay, uh, and their entire character design and, like, weapon was just arms? That'd be crazy. Please stop shooting me with rocket launchers. I, I feel like this is a that's a good sentence to say. Just. Regardless of the context, please don't shoot me with rocket launchers. Like, even if there are no rocket launchers around, just to be safe, it can't hurt. Yeah, stop firing rockets. At, at Bernard's house. He suffers enough living under the road. This holiday season, spare a thought for Bernard's house, which is constantly under siege by trucks, bikes and rockets apparently. Doc, what's your status? I am reviewing the pre-flight checklist now. I have hired contractors to handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Right, and of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden age of unmanned flight? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. Ah, it is simple, awesome. really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world martial security from the pilot seat. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to overwrite their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of uh -huh. the data, the research. Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. I'm starting to think Doctor might be evil. I don't know where I get that, that impression. Maybe from the fact that he's so excited to get hold of all the child brains. I think even even if he's not the bad guy, he's still a good guy. Oh. H2, we could use some support. Roger that. Sending back up. Oh no! Oh god! Oh no! I wasn't, it wasn't quite a glitch. I know what happened. I landed on the outside of the fence when you're supposed to land inside. Because you can fall off the, the side of the stage in this mission. It's not like invisible walls or anything. It's, it's literally just this fence. So, uh, it, I was like on the border. That being said, I know uh, the, this mission is in America, um, so at the point where you're on the border of anything, you're, you're a problem. So. That's my knowledge of America there. 
that and it was founded in 1066 by uh, William Wallisington. Like, don't don't look that up, but I'm fit, I'm pretty sure that's accurate. This man just has a hammer. Oh no. Sixteen sixty nine by Edwin Eddy YouTube. That's true. As uh, it was, America was founded by YouTube. Ow! Now there's two. I don't know. MC Hammer. What, I don't, there's a joke here somewhere. Like a smarter man than me would have come up with the joke, but sadly, I'm me, so all I've got is the ability to cut off his arm and laugh. Bleed the radiator. I don't understand what, what are you talking about? What? If it bleeds, we can kill it. What? You all right? What's bleeding? I don't... <laughs> right, okay. So I, I think you're referring to the endless amount of blood that, I, that came out when I cut this man's arms off. But like... I now I realize you are in fact quoting the great Arnold Schwarzenegger, the, the wisest philosopher of our age. Can I, can, would you, yeah, there we go. Oh no! <laughs> I may have accidentally... Right, this is why I should have bought the mariachi outfit, because then I wouldn't have just hurled myself off the edge of the building. Stealth. But if anyone asks, I did that on purpose, and it was actually an incredible manoeuvre and part of a uh, an Easter egg. Um, I'm pretty sure. So uh, you know. Buy Doge, but no. You're on the company Can't make me. Oh no! I've EM grenaded myself. I was trying to save the hostage, but I guess not. Oh no. I did, I did. This is not financial advice. It's not. 
You, you are correct, because financial advice would require it to have a benefit. Can we donate in Doge? Uh, I don't believe so. But you cannot also, like, donate in Monopoly money, so... I, you can see where the limitations lie. Are you ready to just not see anything for like five minutes? Oh no! We made it. I mean, he could have just got in the lift, but like, I guess not. Railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. Yeah, new gimmick. You have to turn on the AR lens to see anything, but you can't use anything when you're using the AR lens. So you could, you, every time you hit something, it turns off and you have to turn it back on again. It's really fun, this bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Like, you can't even run. You have to... You can jump. You can. You, you're allowed to jump. You know what's more fun? They put a bunch of enemies in here. So now we've got to fight enemies as well. While not being able to see. Can I donate in blood? I mean, yeah. Uh, if you if you sell your blood on the black market. Will you will, will, please turn around, big gorilla man? Harambe, please. Harambe, why you gotta be like this? Can't actually proceed any further until you turn around. Got ya. Yeah. And you're putting lyrics in, but I have no idea what they're for. So I'm just gonna say I can't believe that you're quoting uh, Ace of Club 7. Why did you call it Harambe? Because it looks like a gorilla. button broke for a second there and wouldn't let me uh oh there he is not all gorillas i don't know what you're talking about is uh, that's just that's just a name that i refer to uh, to uh the robot gorillas has is that the name of anything else I mean, this game came out in 2013, and I was saying it then, so I don't know why you're, uh, why you're so worried. Oh, good, more enemies in the dark. I can't see.
got a bit of, I'm sweating because it's so hot. <laughs> I'm genuinely concerned that like my hands are gonna get so sweaty it's gonna like short circuit my controller. There is a major <laughs> like there is a real ahead. worry though. Use it to return to the surface. No, got aircon. Yeah, just rub it in, Bernard. Even if I had aircon, I wouldn't be able to have it on because it would make so much noise. I haven't played the Penny Hill thing. You have to update your, uh, your Spotify Premium for me to do that. to get the deluxe package to have the, uh, the Aaron voice lines. Please don't die of heat stroke. If I didn't die of an actual stroke, I'm not going to die of heat stroke. Like, come on now. Speaking of... Alexa, play the... I don't... You've misunderstood how that works, man. Speaking of, right? Donations still open. Anyway, if uh, no one's watching and, and the thing, hey, I haven't donated yet. Donations are still open. You can give to uh, the Stroke Association. Good, good folk. Uh, I never, I never really utilised their uh, their services personally, but it was, that was more because of my age. <laughs> there were people who needed it a lot more. But yeah, I've, I've, I've seen what they do. They're, they're pretty good, pretty good folk. Would recommend if you, you know, if you're, if you're ever in a position where you need them. Your only way forward pretty handy. Is to return to the surface. So you will exit money. into an evacuated yeah. commercial district. Security is heavy, but you need not worry about collateral damage when engaging the enemy. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. Those stairs lead to a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. Sure. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. Ooh. Right. Just cut him down cold there. So, good news everyone. The, the, the most important thing. I've just received a super important text. 50% off pizzas at Domino's. Watch England with a Domino's. TC app Domino's code. Market deeping. Yeah, I'm alright. Add. <laughs> I'm not paid by Domino's. And I, I actually have no intention of getting a Domino's today. Uh, especially seeing as I'm doing this until 8 o'clock. Right. Oh no, it's Grant. Is this stream sponsored by Rose Shadow Legend? If they want to donate to uh, to the Stroke Association, I will I will shill for Rose Shadow Legends. I I I, I will gladly. I mean, it, where's Where's me undies? Get them on the phone. Say oi. Stop advertising Raid Shadow Legends in the chat. You aren't even getting paid. Not sponsored. It appears there are enemies on the 
overpass. I suggest cutting the road supports. That should bring it down. Yes, sir, to bring bring down Grant. We just oh, we dropped Grant. Tinfa. I still don't know what Tinfa is. Just saying things. Do you need a new website, mate? You know, I consider it. I've been looking at it recently, but I just don't know a place where I can get a website professionally designed and uh, with 24 hours support. This is not financial advice. Okay, right. I was expecting, like, I don't know, some kind of Antifa joke. Let, let me go, Grant is dead. But really, is that right, Bernard? That's uh, does Squarespace offer a competitive package? Package? Yes, package. From now on, Square S S Square them. You know what? Uh, we we're going to skip that sponsorship. That one's that one's not working out. I don't think it's uh, it aligns with my brand of my new my new streaming career that I'm absolutely getting into. As you can tell. You don't, you don't have to keep saying not sponsored. It's a charity stream, Bernard. I can't be sponsored by anyone. Now sponsored by Hypnotoad. Ah, my favourite Pokemon. I don't know why I've just remembered Hypnodisc. Remember Robot Wars? It was Hypnodisc. Actually, that makes complete sense of why I remember Robot Wars right now. I mean, literally, look what's on screen. But, like, it, 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 it really should not appear as, like, my first port of call whenever anyone uses the phrase Hypno. Including, you know, the actual Pokemon Hypno. Remember how Hypno just steals children? Like, that's canon. That man cannot see me. <laughs> Imagine getting all the way onto Robot Wars and then the first thing you do, drive straight into the elimination pit. Right. Like, how many months must you, you put the effort into that? Like. Really, really committed to making a robot and like, like getting it in there and like, surely there's, I'm sure there's like preliminaries or something to show off the robots and stuff. So like, you've got to have gone through all that, and then the first thing you do is you just you just pick up your your robot and throw it into a pit, right? Also, more dogs, but not actually dogs. These ones, like, are not, they even say are not even as smart as real dogs. <laughs> Robot Wars will be the reason AI turns on us. Yep. I mean, I can't wait for Human Wars. Oh, wait. This is not final. I mean, will the robots need financial advice? That's my boy. Game knows what it is. Jesus, Isn't this all a bit much? 
When the villain's just right. Is it friendly for money or sex, religion, fame? But you're a man on a mission, aren't you? Gonna fix everything. Just you. Sword there. Solve everything with violence. Is that it? <laughs> remember, when, remember when Dave asked, can't we solve this peacefully? My sword is a means to an end. To protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now. Maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? When you're chopping them into hamburger? They're adults. They made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. How long do you think it took him to set this to up? In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Like, he's he's, he's like got his silhouette just bouncing between so yes, screens. They sign up for surgery and like, to fight God knows where. Just, just so he can taunt Raiden. When your country's embroiled in civil war, like it's that commitment to shithousery that makes me really like Sam. Inhibiting nano machines and sent right into the blender, your blender. But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nano suppress. Listen to them. What are you talking about? Shh. Wait, he had to time those cyborgs showing up. Can we take them? What's wrong? The way he killed all the others? Oh god. Please god, don't let me die. Let's do this! This isn't fair. Little punk. Listen closely now. Die! They did. And, uh, that's why they even showed earlier they have guns. Finish him off. By these like high frequency like batons. What am I even fighting for? I'm sure that I'm supposed to have some moral conflict right now, but like. Oh no! <laughs> he just got pipe. That's what's happened. They've brought pipes. Does 
they're not... I mean, they're kind of robots. They're as much robots as Raiden is. Raiden, are you injured? Unless you're talking about Bernard's mates, in which case they might be robots. Fair Maybe. Not oh. like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. It appears my statement has upset you. I apologize. No, it's... I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn. Just as any intellect operates, man or machine, altering the course of mankind, is not among my divine directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? Affirmative. We served together on three previous missions. He proved most capable. You think I of him? I have always found him... dependable. Until now. Scouting data for the next area. I'll patrol ahead. You follow. Invest in lead. I am sure you do not intend to abort the mission, but I suggest you avoid combat for the time being. So, uh, currently my moveset is this. <laughs> oh no. Not lead, I said lead. I'm not investing in lead. I've invested in coal. I mean, clearly the uh, the technology of the future right there. Just got a... No lease. You're investing in lease. Or like property. Now it's lead again. You've got to make up your mind, Liam. This is terrible financial advice. Like lead, lead, lead for dogs. Why would you give lead to dogs, you monster? No financial advice. We're not saying invest in lead. These guys invested in lead. Now they're filling me with it. Oh no. I can't. Raiden is very morally conflicted, as you can tell, by the fact that he only has one attack now. You, can't, can't you tell? Having only one attack means moral conflict. Oh, hang on, there he is. I actually can't attack anymore. Well, bye, guys. Just, or is that just what you tell yourself? Go and give. Oh no. <laughs> Invisible walls. How pleased you are to chop away, Jack the Ripper. My name is Monsoon of the Winds of Destruction. Yeah. I guessed as much. Monsoon, or as he is actually known, the Human Slinky. <laughs> 
feasting on the insides of your enemies? How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me, who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? Top tier You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Kill or be killed, Jack. Phenom Pen taught me that. Yes, you aren't the only one to grow up on a kill. Yay. War I can look cool around. Parent, but an effective teacher. Its final lesson is carved deep in my psyche. That this world and all its people are diseased. Free will is a myth. Religion is a joke. Controlled by something greater. Memes. The DNA of the soul. Memes. It's all about memes. They are the culture. They this is a very serious scene. Expose someone to anger long enough, they hate. They become a carrier. Of the memes. This is my sword. Oh, there's a cat. This is a very serious scene. Is that a meme? You can't fight nature, Jack. Wind blows, rain falls, and the strong like, prey upon the weak. Like... Sam tells me you see your weapon as a tool. Something that saves lives, a means of justice. Oh, no, oh, oh, no. Now there's a pretty meme. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lies. Oh, I can't. Sorry, what were we talking about? Guilt when you enjoyed it. <laughs> the cat sadly does not backflip. That is, until the illusion was broken. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. Are you ready for the most edgy scene? You have no choices to make. Nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. You're right. About me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak, but I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good. Really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! Ooh. The bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee deep in bodies. Wake me you? up. But Wake you, me up and all this up. is a wake-up call to what I really believe, what I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. Turn off my pain inhibitors. What? This... This is madness. You... Do it! All right.
I'll take this dance. No, sir. Report back to the chief. He's mine. <laughs> You're the boss. I misjudged you. You are like us after all. Now you're just being nasty. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? I don't know how I got these scars. Actually, why don't I give you a demonstration? <laughs> I think it's time for Jack to let her rip. Immediately followed by a guitar solo. It was very nice of the uh, the doctor to install the uh, the red aura generators in Crichton's body, so that he can glow, and uh, whenever he unleashes Ripper mode, which is what this is called, and it, it's this is also the only time I'm going to use Ripper mode because it uses up all your fuel. So I'm like, okay. Uh, but Ripper Mode doesn't work against bosses, <laughs> so essentially all it's doing is giving it a damage boost, but they gave Monsoon loads of health to compensate, so it's essentially useless. Like, literally nothing has changed. Music's good though. But all that angst, and what we get is a, a boss, a boss fight. That's, that's it. Pretty good boss fight though. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, that's the, you do get infinite blade mode, which is fun. actually fighting me from across the like the arena. Look, just send his legs to fight me. Yeah, remember when I said, hey, don't remember those electromagnetic grenades? But I was like, those are useless except for one boss fight, and then I'll point out what it is. There's the callback. Enjoy. It really pays to be invested in, in this video game.
just doing combos on his head. Please stop stabbing me. Yes, it hurts very much. Have you ever been stabbed? It hurts. You can just avoid that, but why would you? Dogecoin to the moon. Why are you just spamming Dogecoin to the moon? I don't understand. This is not financial advice. Hideo <laughs> Kajira is turning in his grave. I'm I'm pretty sure he's still produced on it. Also, Hideo Kojima's not dead is the obvious like, issue with that statement, but like... I'm pretty sure he did work on it. He was still at Konami at that stage. That's my brother in the chat, by the way, if anyone wants to uh, to make fun of him. It's a pretty good song. See, I can't tell if you're making fun of it, Liam, but I genuinely like this song. <laughs> to be fair, the actual version is like two minutes long, so like... <laughs> wait until it shows the the character before I can <laughs> You you are not wrong. This this song is most definitely Scott not Scott he doesn't know. Like you are factually correct. That's his, uh, that's yeah, I think it's ten percent for all the bosses. You get them to ten percent, that's their, their like limit. Essentially, anything after that is just bonus. Just beating them up because you can. Oh, what will I ever do? Oh, I just run along the thing. Because you've just given me a ramp to get to you. Can you play some Farm Simulator 2019? Don't actually own it, so uh, sadly not. Just cut him into 432 parts. What difficulty is this? I only put it on normal. Did not put it on uh, on hard. I have I have technically beaten the game on Revengeance, but that was when I had functional arms. So. Don't be ashamed. I'm playing Ghost Simulator. 
running its course. Your memes end here. The memes end oh, here, guys. It's over. Gone. Memes are done. To you, sure as the sun will rise. I'm just gonna just log on to Steam Hello. one day and just I see uh and just just find Dave Pierce has has purchased has purchased farming simulator for you. Oh okay. Two hundred two How tall is two meters? Ripper mode tutorial. Yeah, I don't think you need a tutorial for press a button, become strong. Right in? I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later. You got big rig? No, I don't have big rigs. If you're, if you're talking about what I think you're talking about, no, definitely not. Tactical sigh. <laughs> Again, another another weapon that I will just not use. Because why would I invest in that when I can invest in my sword? Or alternatively, a mariachi uniform. <laughs> Stop naming terrible video games. Oh, I could No, I can't buy I, I thought it was in, uh, in green there. Never mind. How tactical? Good question. Like, uh, and if a tie, if a tie, a side can be tactical. What makes a non-tactical side? I know, Bernard. Child, you green. It's already on there. I'm not even asking the question now. I'm just, just rolling with it. But yeah, if if this is a tactical side, what sides are not tactical? Because if you, I suppose, if you're setting your tactics around the psi, then yeah, sure, you can make that a tactical psi. But like, uh, is a non-tactical psi like you've just turned up to a children's birthday party with it? <laughs> you killed Monsoon. I'm impressed. The brains are in the server room undergoing training. Oh yeah, this game Not is about so child bad. brains. Go. Howdy. I'm sorry, sir. Our business hours for the day have ended. We I'm are go looking forward to your next visit. I'm going to react like one of our customers. How dare you! Watch out! Keep on coming! I've been sworn at enough to justify that one. Oh, you have no idea. I... One day I'm gonna write memoirs, and it's like I'm gonna I'm gonna need an entire book just for things customers have said to me. I, f I feel like that's. That, that's something that would immediately improve the job. If all... If it, like, imagine if you were a waiter, and, like, 
once a day, you're allowed to fight to the death one customer. Like, and you get to pick them. Because if you ever couldn't win the fight, you'd just not pick that person. But like, if someone was rude to you, and you could just fight them to the death, no one's going to be rude to you. I'm just saying, it's, uh, it's a good, good way of solving all disputes. Like all of them in history. I'm not saying that I've just like created peace in the Middle East. But that's basically how I do it, is make customer service people allowed to like <laughs> One day you just you just wake up and you you go, right, this is this is my target for the day. And it, it turns out to be like what like, Mike Tyson or something. Probably not Mike Tyson. I feel like you'd probably recognise Mike Tyson, but you get my point. Yeah, so... Raiden, Sundowner contacted you from the top floor. Time to make your way up there. We've got to get up to the top floor. Wait a minute, why are you handing me all of these items? Jack. This is, uh, I can't prove it's not the same guy. Wouldn't that be a crossover in a half? Out of nowhere, just Sterling Archer ch turns up. The elevators appear to be disabled, which we should have expected. Sterling. I I will access the control unit. Perhaps you can hack an elevator and make it operational. Ooh, splendid idea. By all means, yes. Hmm? It seems the guards are storming the building. Right, <laughs> did, the did you expect a turret section? Why didn't you expect a turret section? Give them hell. In, in this game about robot ninjas. How did you not see a turret section coming? I just realized someone's behind me. Hello. Ow. Ow. Please stop shooting me with rocket launcher. <laughs> I mean, they say guards are storming the building. I'm not gonna lie, they've sent the basic. I, I, I can one shot these guys. Like, Archer and Metal Gear seems like mixing cheese and petrol. I've done. Have, have you tried it? Maybe it's good? You never know. No one expects the turret section. It, I, I feel like... I feel like uh, Archer fits into this game better than a turret section does. Oh no, the turret is gone. I guess I'll use this other turret that's just here. Why, why are there turrets? Enough with the guard. Just get in the elevator. Oh, right, yeah, the elevator's in. Uh, I don't want the battle points. Oh. Please stop. Ow. Don't every office have two turrets? I mean... 
Yeah, but usually they're pointing inwards to stop people from leaving. Alright, so I have a new plan, and that is I'm shooting the rocket launchers. Oh, that takes a while to reload. You aren't allowed to have arms anymore. Neither are you. Just played mode the other direction, it's fine. There's a grab here. Why is there? <laughs> I can't. Oh no, I actually can't go down there. It's fine, I have a turret. This game is about robot brains. Sometimes it's just worth... I got an S rank for that. What? For the for a turret section, I got I got an S rank. I, I just don't question anything anymore. For security purposes, the building is divided into upper and lower halves. The lower area consists of offices and meeting space for staff and visitors, while confidential military projects and technical research are restricted to the upper levels. That's the thing, so I've been like B rank the, the entire game. Up top. Like, Indeed. constantly B rank, B rank, B rank. I just get destroyed by two Harambes and all of a sudden it's like, yeah, you're getting an S rank for that because you used a turret. Area. Let me guess. Time to find another left hand? Well, that is the problem. Security cyborgs would not have sufficient clearance. But managers and senior staff have already been evacuated, no doubt. So... The only option is to cut the power to the security gate, which will not be easy. It is powered by no less than three systems, including a backup power supply. You will need to destroy all of the electrical control panels to disable them. In any case, you should arrive at the 20th floor soon. The electrical panels are most likely hidden in the walls. Use your enhanced AR to search for any unusual heat sources inside the walls there. RP crew, I don't even remember what that is. We are mission 14, hooray. There could be an electrical panel. Ah. Oh. No choice now. Don't forget don't forget, right? You, during all of this, during the I was born to kill, you need to take a doom. It's a priority. Like, I know there are children that are like missing their brains and so on, and uh, the organ harvesting, and they were being gassed. But, like, you know, I have to take a doom.
Howdy. Oh, he's got an arm. Of course he's got everything. All of them have arms on him. I mean, like, he's got a green arm. Which I'm pretty sure is a sign of gangrene, so if you think about it, I did him a favour. How do you feel now? Are you happy with your life? Have you, have you considered how your action... Ow! Alright. I gave him a chance to think about it. Oh. about what happened to the last one you had a go at me. Spoiler alert, he has no legs or face. I will get to you in a minute. What have we got left? After this mission, there's the escape, then a boss fight, then the final mission. So, yeah, so I'd say just over halfway. Panel nearby. Use your unhack. Yes, that should take care of security. Now, head back to the gate. Nothing. Oh, no, there is a thing. It's held. It's actually not, it's a hollow chip. Oh, well. That was a B rank though. into cyborgs, but you, well, your past is most, uh... What you getting at, Doc? Most of the time, you're working with first-world ex-military. 
grown men. Compared to the average third world child soldier, I can't really complain. Most of them, they're the sort of gorillas your typical patient gets paid to slaughter. Uh, it's so but, itchy. Uh, this shouldn't be news to you, Doc. Uh, yes, yes, but uh... look. Just help me take you, care you of You pay for the whole game, but you'll only need the edge. I do edge. my business, you do yours. Uh, yes. All right, yeah, let's see. Right. I'll see you later. Do not have to fight every enemy you Cobble box, add it to the list. Oh no. I have to hold down the right trigger. Nice of them to blow open the door for me, yeah? <laughs> Idiots. Hi. Electromagnetic grenade. I'm never going to use them again. They're really, uh, they're really only useful for that fight. And it's done now. It's George. This is, yeah, he's back for revenge. You have no idea how much I would enjoy it if we just kept on like cutting bits off of George until he just became a like like complete robot, he, and he was just a ground. The question remains, why didn't we do this to begin with? Um, the answer may surprise you. It also may not, because I don't know. analyzing the latest security data. You should find an indoor garden up ahead. A garden? Sounds fancy. A Japanese garden, to be precise. It is an area set aside for VIPs. Apparently, one of World Marshal's directors is a rather serious Japanese culture enthusiast. Oh, good. All right. So what's this got to do with me? Is there something I need from the garden? Not at all. You need only pass through that area to arrive at a freight elevator. I found a route to the elevator controls through the unit we hijacked downstairs. I have located the server room as well. You can reach it via the freight elevator. Great work, Doc. Elementary, my dear Raiden. Now, head for the garden. I right, so if you know the development of this game, you know that when the developer Platinum picked it up, it was basically just a bunch of broken pieces that they slapped together. That has never been more obvious than when you got what? <laughs> you walk, walk into a, a lobby and it's it's a, an entire Japanese garden and castle. And their explanation is, yeah, one of the directors is directors is a weed.
it just completely normal. Oh god, that was a rocket launcher. hand you know there's 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 probably a better explanation for why the doctor wants all of these right hands um, other than the, they, that's you know where they keep the data but I just can't think of why he'd want them it just does not occur to me That, that that little trick there makes this entire section worth it. Right, time for platforming. The main exit is sealed. I very much doubt you can get through there. The catwalk above you was connected to a uh, corridor meant for transporting material. Right you can take right. that to the elevator. Ah, oh, rest in peace, Splinter Cell. Literally the only reason to come up here, fairly certain. Wasn't there something? Wait. Is there something? Is there a, uh, there a box that I missed or something? Otherwise, this feels like a. I, I think on the Xbox version you get an achievement for for cutting that thing, but other than that, feels like a bit of a waste of potential. Game. Are you are you sleeping on the incredible feat that is Metal Gear Solid Portable Ops? The game so good they had to declare it non-canon just to get away with how good it was. Except expecting you to please stop kicking me. Oh, yeah, milk it acid. <laughs> I think I would prefer to actually be on acid.
Ow. Oh, got Metal Gear Survive. Oh, I've, I've played that as well. It's bad. <laughs> it's real, like... Like... And not even, like, defensively bad. Like, Portable Ops, where you can say, well, it's on the, it's on the PSP. Like... Like, it is just straight up terrible. I just got knocked out by an umbrella. Yeah, that, that's just true. There, there were no more Metal Gear games after that. There was definitely no pachinko machines either. because it's a million degrees but like he's doing air combos on me you have one leg you are not a threat only thing to look forward to at E3. Yeah. The Metal Gear Acid remake. It's what, it's what we've all been waiting for. Hooray data storage. I don't actually know what that does. But thanks, I guess. So someone Google that for me. What does right. the state the data storage do in this game? Uh, like all the others, because I know you get all the MIBs, you get the wooden sword. Right, apologies, Raiden. I seem to have fallen behind. No worries. Actually, I should thank you. What are you talking about? If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have gotten Jack back. Then, that is your true nature. More or less. Still interested? I find no reason to alter my objectives. From the moment we met, you have acted on emotional urges. You speak of protecting those weaker than you. Such people number in the billions. It is impossible. You cannot save every human being in the world. You cannot save every street child. After extended observation, I have come to a conclusion. Your actions are rooted in affinity for those from similar circumstances as yours. Huh. Guess so. The stun blade. Not much oh. of a superhero That's... after all, huh? However, That's your emotional status useless. is understandable. Perhaps I share this same affinity. At least well, the wooden sword is funny. And glad to have you along. Oh right. yeah. You can reach the server room via the freight elevator just ahead. Uh, Jack, Jack the Ripper, can't forget about that one. But don't worry, they'll forget about it in like five minutes. I 
I didn't I didn't need to take that guy's spine. I'll be honest, but you know. Alright, and it's hungry. got all the endurance upgrades so far as well just by accident I've played through this game a few times I don't get to use air very much, that's nice. There we go. Take taking out the cows. I don't I don't remember if there was ever an explanation for for why they move. I mean why the geckos move, not cows, though they move because it's it's all they've got to say. Look up, Reifen! Another freight platform. Look out! Incoming! Oh good, it's one of you. Imagine like being that guy, the guy that got a shield. Like some people have got like hammers or have got, like super suits or something. He's just got a shield. Still a bee. Isn't that just Captain America? I guess, but like in a world where everyone is Captain America. <laughs> you know what? It's basically just US agent. That's what's happened there. Like, he hasn't got anything. He's just, he's just a regular guy and they've just handed him a shield and said, go nuts. You are the shield guy now. Thank <laughs> you. 
Like for, the, for the wiki guys, blade mode is basically just a yeah. I'm I, I'm just gonna kill you button. Which a why not? I guess. Why isn't that conveniently timed? Hi. See that got me an A. Yeah, deploying security from the top floor to the freight elevators. You pass to the server room feeds right through them. Please let me use the air attack on the guys who are flying. Please go. That's very nicely. Just gonna cut that guy's arm. I don't want to stop you. Also, I want to stop the game targeting you. Get on the floor. Everybody walk the dinosaur. Necessary. Oh, good. Now there's two of them. Mastiffs. They're not easy. Stop punching me in the face. Ow. Right. Now one down. The other one shouldn't be too much trouble. No kills. Um, I are you are you sure? I feel like I killed some people. I feel like I killed a lot of people. Don't worry though. I guess. Hmm.
They didn't have soul. They don't count as people. Ten technically, at that point, do I do every fight with no kills? Now, where do we draw the line here? The server rooms ahead? Yes, according to what I have here. What should I expect to find? If they're VR training those brains, I'm guessing it won't look like your typical IT department. Quite right. Most of it will likely be occupied by life support units. Feeding oxygen and nutrition to the brains they have stored, you know. They would also need a server to feed them the VR data, but in terms of structure, it's really more brain storage and maintenance than a server room. But no doubt it makes a convenient euphemism for what they are really doing there. Yeah. Like how CIA agents refer to where they work as the company. Indeed. Something like that would never arouse the suspicions of rank and file staff who may hear it. And I'm sure those complicit in this operation feel better not calling it the VR training room. Even something so simple as a name can help one ignore the truth of what they are doing. Truly fascinating how the human brain works. So this whatever room, that's where Sundowner is waiting, right? If he wants a fight, I wish he'd just get on with it. He didn't seem the type to run and hide. Well, he is in charge of security, but I suspect this is not about business. If I had to guess, I would say he is toying with you, testing you, perhaps. Whatever he's doing, it won't change what's going to happen once I finally catch up with him. Are you saying you're not enjoying the back and forth between German stereotype and edgelord Magoo? Body, a, a way of reusing the boss fight. It's fine because they also reuse the music, which is pretty good. So. I wonder if there'll be any more repeat boss fights. Oh look, it's the one I just fought. An experiment soon? Well, as you say, I controlled. It should pose no problem for you, yes? Oh, my God. 
Oh yeah, there's a... Oh well. Oh, there's an excuse to, uh, to use those electromagnetic grenades again. Please take your legs back. It's very rude. Uh, I can't tell where his head is to hit it. It won't let me lock on to him for some reason. There we go. That is some tactical psi use. I looked at I looked at those size and thought, damn. That's tactical. Ah, it's my favourite scene. Don't disrupt the students while class is in session. I believe you're familiar with the lesson plan. The same regimen you went through in Liberia. Effective program. Just look how you turned out. Of course, running it in the real world just got a bit too complicated. Doing it virtually, though, no fuss, no muss. Straight to the brain. It's like a dream. Well, maybe dream is the wrong word. They do kill some POWs, some civilians. <laughs> they enjoy it. We give their pleasure centers a nice big jolt every time. <laughs> Plus, they get a shiny new body as a graduation present. Another thing you have in common. I chose this. They're kids, you son of a bitch. And kids are cruel. All people are by nature. They just lose touch with it as they get older. Start thinking they know right and wrong. That's immoral. War crime this, code of conduct that. Kids, you can mold, manipulate into performing all kinds of atrocities. And there's nothing like a good atrocity to keep a war going. That's why I'm shutting you down. Huh. You just don't see the bigger picture, do you? The bigger picture Save as he reaches for the child's brain. Bolts out of the rubble with all these precious brains. Nothing changes. Oh, we forgot to take a dupe. All the guys in charge are long gone. We've got offices around the world. We're just suppliers. We don't create the market for war. And who does? The Patriots are gone. <laughs> Those guys just managed the war economy. They didn't invent it. Did you think every battle in history was all part of some big old conspiracy? Bullshit! War is just part of who we are. Why fight it? Hey, no Metal Gear Solid 4. Didn't matter. Anyway. 
none of this will matter in three hours. Demand for PMCs is about to skyrocket. Like the good old days after 9-11. The good old days after 9-11. Actual dialogue. So far, we've got maybe they haven't touched any more kids yet, and the good old days after 9 11. data storage. Daylight, yeah, the, the sudden draw is nice. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a shame the dialogue coming out of it isn't um, exactly top tier, but you know. Enjoyable. Done it again. I keep on using the repair nano paste by accident. Just need to uh give me a sec. Can't actually get over there. Uh, to collect it, but hey, you know, why not? How's this, Jack? We can play up here without damaging the merchandise. What happens in three hours? <laughs> Don't matter. Uh, I'll have four right. hours left of this stream. Even at Mach 2, you wouldn't make it. And killing you is gonna take some time. Slow and painful. Does happen in three hours. We'll find out. Uh, the fun there thing about time is it it moves linearly. So if you just wait three hours, you'll find out what happens in three hours. Right. I, I don't believe it either, but it turns out that's how it works. You can be cooler than that, Jack. He is an iPad man. You are correct. Keep your blade away from the shield. Your body should analyze it for you. How does it? Uh, I mean, it's the guy that killed him. Are we getting a Sora's... Oh, I wish I thought to do a Sora's Wrath. Oh. Yeah, the mu music is kind of sonic isn't it? It's a very Japanese butt rock. Live and learn. Ow, ow. Okay, really should have dodged that. Please stop shooting me. I 
I can beat him without taking all of his shields off. This is a Christian stream. Oh no. Ow. 410 trillion dead Prime Ministers. At this point, it wouldn't surprise me. denomination of Christianity. Uh, Pentecostalism. Please stop hitting me with your shield. Uh, yeah, Quaker. We're actually uh, sponsored by Quaker Oats. We're, we're not. This is not financial advice. See, I remember his shields being really easy to take down. I, I don't know if I'm just remembering it incorrectly. Or if I was just better then. <laughs> Money going into Quake Coin. That is that a thing? That's probably a thing. This is not financial advice. Quake coin just crashed, oh no. There we go. Stop advertising Dogecoin. Yes, I know dog money. Ow. Oh, yep, that's the end. Done. Sorted. See you later. Guess we're off now. End of game. See ya. Oh, no. Got to go back through that level again. Oh, ma magic ability is is just created, right? Raiden can now hack things with his sword. What are you talking about? He could do this before all the time. It just, I don't know what you're on about. He always had this ability. Why are you surprised? And again... Why didn't he just do this to get up here in the first place? Good question. <laughs> 
See, I told you, Christian stream. <laughs> right. If this works, it's going to be very enjoyable. But if it doesn't, oh well. It's over. <laughs> Hello. What happens in three hours? I accidentally did this the first time I played it. <laughs> And it's my favourite anything, like, like cut-up concept in this game. Because if you're just cutting, what they're expecting you to go nuts. So if you just do it once, you can cut his like entire upper arm off. And he's just waving at you from the ground. I've taken Marshal HQ. Yeah, yeah. I have just entered Denver airspace. I will be there soon. Hurry. Right. What Sundowner said. I know. Anything that'll rival 9-11 cannot be good. <laughs> really? Else, maybe less. He said even Mac 2 could not get there in time. If he was serious, that's over 4,000 miles away. Yes, this is the 167th so cutscene. It uh, we're aiming American for 10,000. If it's going to spike demand for PMCs, it's got to be a political hotspot. A coup or civil war in a stable region wouldn't have a domino effect. And they'd want to draw in a superpower. No. What? The president. He's on his way to Pakistan. If something happens to him there... Oh, shit. The war on terror part two. Contact the military. Official channels are frozen since Mexico. Unofficial channels would take too long. Besides, what's our proof? Who's going to believe us over World Martian? Then we have to get there first. He's still there. It just the just, just waving the as we discuss, we like, the, right now. the assassination of the close. president. Hold up. It's not a jet we need. Courtney? An RLV would make it with time to spare. Hmm. That's... Mach 23, if we're talking one atmosphere. 17,650 miles per hour. That would make Pakistan in under half an hour. Right. It's also just souls. the fact that his, his body is just doing a crab walk in the back. Stan Ridgeway camouflage. I, I, is, th is this a peasant reference that I don't understand? Custom body, Desperado version. Pincer Blade Bloodlust. Um. More customization. I'll show you what the Desperado version looks like. It's. Uh, <laughs> it definitely stands out. But like, it, if you want red, if you, if you want you want the Inferno armor. Usually I like black and red as a color scheme, but this is the, the red's just too bright. It just nah. But then again, we are we are wearing the baby sick green, so. Uh, we got enough. Yeah, we got enough money for uh, all of that. Unique weapon, pincer blades. Again, just not going to use them. Why would I bother? Oh, okay. I didn't realise how much that costs, but uh, hey, I can get the fuel cell next time. One day, one day I'll get sweet kick. <laughs> Yes, I know, Bernard. Oh. Cargo's all set to go, sir. Excellent. Commencing takeoff in I've just I've just remember what cutscene this is. I'm gonna just take a drink because this is gonna take a while. <laughs> this is a this is a long this is a long cutscene. You know, 
This kind of space launch once required days of preparation. Solus has been conducting test flights almost every day for the last six months. As long as we're not breaking atmosphere, they said they can reroute today's flight no problem. Amazing! The Earth is the cradle of humanity, but mankind cannot stay in the cradle forever. <laughs> I'm only going as far as the thermosphere. This thing can't pass the Carmen line. That lunar vacation will just have to wait. And here I was hoping you might Mouse. bring me back a monolith. Scheiße! Two he don't talk about the doctor, because he kind of does look Who like else? a mouse. The flight pattern suggests now that I think about it. I know we've been attacked by planes. English map? What? Shit. This is a transport I don't understand. Chopper. Our defensive options are limited. Missiles incoming! Flight. And people say Germans aren't funny. The uh, the curse is gone now. OBS being a little um temperamental. Chopper around. Again, that hacking ability he apparently had the entire game. Do you want just just not physics? Welcome to not physics. Leave his chin alone. He's already been chainsawed once today. Is it today? The time frame's not clear. Sacrifice will not be forgotten. Very clearly not dead. Could I, can you imagine? That was quite the fall, Raiden. No I'm suspense. Glad to see that you are all right. It's time you got out of Denver. Yeah, might be on his feet as well. Forget, the, forget this, like, mercenary stuff. Why isn't he in the gymnastics?
Okay, you just didn't want me to have his spine, I guess. Mm. Really do with some repair nano paste. Brighton, are you alright? I can handle this. You just get those brains out of here. And what will you do? Get out of here and to the launch site. Ah, the young ladies' company, yeah? How fortunate they are in Colorado, too. Yeah. Shouldn't take more than two hours with a set of wheels. Guess I'll just have to borrow some. A lot of cars got abandoned when the evac order came down. But won't the roads be blocked? If you are struck by one of those missiles, or... I know. Let me just worry about putting some distance between me and World Marshal. What's left of it. Please stop kicking me. I swear I should not be this intimidated by geckos, but like, I have not been on top of them. So I'm going to treat them like a threat for once. Where did you go? Oh, hello. what was more impressive about that landing it wasn't the fact that he landed on his feet it's the fact that he went on the helicopter on that plane on the helicopter again and still landed like 30 feet outside the building he was on like there's some time space continuum stuff happening there Surprising number of these. Right, thank you for that for that, uh, that addition there, Bernard. It may be an RLB, but it still needs time to accelerate and decelerate from first cosmic velocity. It could require more than 30 minutes to get to Pakistan.
Yeah, I think this game is set in like 2017 or something. <laughs> well, like, it could take almost 30 minutes to get to Pakistan from Denver. Uh, game knows what it is. Please stop. It just grabbed me out of the air. Yeah, I can't but can't believe that now we've gone back to using jets again. Uh, we've, we've just given up on the uh, the cyborg thing. We've just decided to not now. So that's that's cool, I guess. Actually, now that I think about it, wasn't 2017 the year that Metal Gear Survive came out? If, if that's the case, that's an amazing coincidence. An amazing and disappointing coincidence. Oh no, I accidentally walked into it. <laughs> yeah, I'm really looking forward to the day you're born, Bernard. It's going to be a good time, I reckon. We, we might celebrate the day you're born every year. Uh, you know what, I think we should do that for everyone. It's on Dogecoin. Oh, okay. Re repeatedly flip at the wall, it's fine. Right. I will 
join you in Pakistan. I will find a way to exit the helicopter. Proceed out of the city. I will contact you when I am on the ground. I'm not saying buy Dogecoin, but uh, yeah. Came all this way Enemy, for melons. I oh, know. Oh god. Ow. That is my face. I'm using that. I mean, it is also, like, recently it was five years since Harambe was killed. So, for knowing too much. Please stop. Stop this. Harambox. Can launch after Dino Coin. Do you, mean, do you mean Raid Shadow Legends? Got to be done. It's got to be done. Uh, well, I've got a minute. I will say, if you haven't donated already, see the the links in the description. The video worth worth doing. It's a uh, it's, it's a good stop. Stop it! I'm not sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. It's a good cause, and uh, you know, if, if, if everything that you can give means a little something to someone. So, I had someone apologise to me for only giving a fiver, and I'm like, mate, still a fiver. <laughs> not going to say no. You have passed the last of the barricades. Save your strength. Find a vehicle. Right. That should do nicely. <laughs> the 
not sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. God. Of course there's a motorbike. You think he's going to get in a car? Like a peasant? Oh. Just taking a sip of my beverage. Seeing as it's a million degrees in here. He's done it again. Tom Cruise rides, rides a motorbike. You're, you're not wrong. He also runs a lot, which Raiden does. I'm just saying. No, I've never seen them. Never seen them in the same place at the same time. Days Gone. I've not played it. I've heard either very good or very bad things about it. So it's like, yeah, very consistently B-rated. Apparently there's another fuel cell I can buy, but I'm done with life cells. But, thank, thanks, William. But believe it or not, I'm acutely aware of the symptoms of a stroke. But I'm, I'm going to assume that that is for the assistance of people in the chat. And, uh... <laughs> right, time for the best mission in the game. This game is about child harvesting and stealing brains. Everything okay on your side? I am out of Colorado airspace. <laughs> Good. Ride to hell, revengeance. I'm there. How did they out Kojima, Kojima? Because it's Platinum Games. They they, they just do. Have you played Near Automata? They out Yoko Taro to Yoko Taro. To be fair, this is how tense it is when I see I someone else petting a dog and I'm not allowed. Heart to heart, I have analyzed his words and actions. I am unable to ascertain his motivation. Ah. <sighs> Fancy meeting you here. You knew I'd come. I'm really I suppose confused I should thank you by for the... not killing everyone at the launch site. Uh, what? Why? Is... <laughs> I I appreciate well, you guys you posting like facts about strokes in, in the chat. It's, a, it's good to get that You're information out. But I'm just job. confused why you've started now. The war is the big payoff. Right. Big raises all around once World Marshal gets all those contracts. I'm not talking about money, Jack. Say no to the chocolates. I'm talking ideals. N no. Excuse me. <sighs> Forget it. We've both heard enough speeches about higher causes by now. That line is why Sam is History the best villain in Metal Gear. Decide who's right. End of story. I, neither of us care what the other one wants to say. Let's just do the fight. <laughs> Uh, you know, oh, it's still during working hours. You probably well, shouldn't be good. this high. Yes, I like that. Must you it's not even 420 yet. Don't interfere. Be 
this is between us. <laughs> Blade Wolf is the tumbleweed. <laughs> and it ends here. Okay. Let's dance! just stand here there's the tumbleweed it's there <laughs> it just <laughs> oh i didn't know, i didn't know that was going to happen to be fair i wonder if i just stand here is he ever going to attack me thanks i i, I appreciate it but like i i don't have the energy all the time <laughs> Like, it's the reason I've taken this entire week off, because I know I'm going to be knackered tomorrow. And, like, I have I have other hobbies, and, like, uh, uh, and work, and actually playing video games rather than streaming them. So, I... Like, don't get me wrong, it's been a lot of fun today, but I could not do this on a regular basis. I just couldn't. So, I'm not built that way. <laughs> I, maybe, maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll have a look into doing it again next year. Let's see if I can. Uh... <laughs> Thanks, Bernard. Uh, yeah, I tell you what, I've just. Uh, that, that's my priority, Bernard. I spend ninety-eight percent of my time just wanking. That's that's the yeah. That's what I've been doing. Not, not at all, you know, setting up the charity stream. Ow. Yeah, I've, I've, I'm, I've got tomorrow off and uh, I'm only working a half day Friday, so I'm, I've got plenty of time to... <laughs> Shut up, <laughs> I've got plenty of time to... <laughs> Stop calling me a malacca. I've got plenty of time to, uh, to rest and relax after this. <laughs> the charity stream of wanking is the same thing. I mean, I don't think that I'm going to do streams on OnlyFans, but you never know. I'm kind of. <laughs> this is supposed to be like the big showdown of the game, and we've what we've accidentally done is turned it into jokes about wanking. I'm not saying it's Bernard's fault. Oh, but you almost kill me at the uh, at the driving range. And now, now this. Oh. I mean, you're not wrong. It is, in fact, not just getting started. It's in fact the end of the fight. <laughs> oh, don't don't bring that up because <laughs> like knowing the context of the final boss. <laughs> Could easily happen. He is dead. He barely had any cyborg enhancements. Just yeah, Was that's that's how the uh, they get around the whole Evidence. you didn't win thing. Was basically saying, yeah, he was actually just AIs a normal guy. He had like one cyborg arm. No That's it. Answer. Otherwise, it 
100% human. Human conflict stems from opposing ideals and societal norms. I suppose that's not 100%. Whatever. With these guidelines. You're better off figuring those out for yourself. Oh, no, no, don't. <laughs> Don't, because people, there are people that will genuinely believe that, like, Metal Gear Solid 4 is a, is about, like, the, the, the creation of the Israeli state and stuff. I, it, there, there will be people out there that genuinely believe this stuff. get your rest. He's left the bike there. <laughs> Someone's going to hit that. Hence best mission. And I got a B rank. <laughs> Yay. Still got like 15,000 BP. Get here quick. Leave the vehicle. Just run. I'm not going to be able to afford fuel cell. And here's the thing. I don't, yeah, I can't, I can't afford these either. What? Let's, uh... Shoot. I, I, I wish we could afford the mariachi uniform. <laughs> yeah, just Naruto run the entire way to Pakistan. Yes, Bernard. If you say the words, babysit green. I'm finally gonna. Oh no! I unlocked. I unlocked. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I. I unlocked sweep kick only for two more things to unlock. Ah, uh, it's fine. I suppose, not to spoil it, but yeah, this is the, the last mission we're going into now. Now that the main villain is dead. This is a... This game is about... Murdering children and stealing their brains. Are you, uh, Mr. Ryden? Remember when the Prime Minister was uh, assassinated? Where is she? <laughs> Tell her you've arrived. Uh, it was Bible Black. Hi Look it there, up. Stranger. Hey, you're looking good. Aw, who's your little friend? Oh, it's a long story. Shake? <laughs> good boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's George. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Really. <laughs> it's okay. That guy's Follow George me. all along. So exactly what kind of You'll see. You built that? Yep. Ha! Uh -huh. 
hybrid lace ramjet engine I designed. Well, are you in a hurry or not? <laughs> right. Hey. Thanks, Sonny. Hmm? <laughs> Switch off all cell phones and portable gaming devices. And remember, this is a no smoking flight. <laughs> Roger. Ready for countdown. No time for that. Ignition! Like a, like a father that just doesn't believe in her at all. Just, it's like, you built that. Yeah, right. Mm. It's a nice picture. No, really, though, there's even, like, legal information in the bottom left of that page. Like, why have they put so much detail into that? Because Japan, yeah, that's a, a, a fair explanation. Well, anything? Nothing. You sure we got the right place? I, I think they had they had the uh, the rocket laying around. They were like, we've got to use the rocket. All right. If we don't spend a billion this year, we won't get a billion the next year. about getting that grant money. Stealth. To be fair, when you meet the, the future candidate for president, you start to understand how this uh, this version of reality has gone slightly wrong. You see that? Their EXIF codes show up as unaffiliated. Wait, Marshall has the security contract for the space. Why would they have their cyborg set to the same illegal EXIF code as Desperado? It's evidence against them. No, it's their alibi. They're making it look like Desperado hacked their soldiers on site because everyone knows Desperado has a contract with... The Pakistani rebels. Oh, but if we go public with the Desperado-Marshall connection, I'm really yeah. glad they're explaining now this at the very last nice minute. Big foreign threat all cooked up and ready to serve. The media and the public won't be able to resist. Remember WMDs in Iraq? Damn it, you're right. It's another slam dunk. What about any humans on the base? Marshall no, this is this is a, a really realistic story. Most likely, or brain jacked if they needed them to keep up appearances. Huh. They'd never publicize what airport the president was flying into. Not in this region. And almost no one would have access to an outside line for security reasons. It wouldn't be difficult to keep things hush-hush. At least until Air Force One arrives. I'm heading for the control tower. If I can destroy the antenna array, the U.S. military will know something's wrong. Good idea. Be careful. Sam's gone. And I blew the winds of destruction away. 
I'll be fine. Yeah, it'd be really weird if, like, a really over-the-top caricature of a villain turned up at the 11th right. hour to, no time to worry about just the Get to the control tower. show us up. That'd be, be real weird. <laughs> Alright, who just shot me with a rocket launcher? Is it you? It's you, isn't it? You know how much I don't like being shot by rocket launchers. Is this a Capcom game? This is not a Capcom game. It's a Konami game. I mean, technically, it's a Konami game. Mm. Konami don't really do games anymore. They do investments. Somehow ended up with half of the left hands in the game, despite not really aiming for them at all. <laughs> Have I told you about rocket launchers? Very rude. Too much pachinko, yeah. That's uh It's a case where it's like this this sort of business practice in if like in like a, a functional economy would not work. Like you shouldn't succeed by doing something more shady, but because you know because it isn't a functional economy. They can just get away with what they want. Oh no! We thought it was going to be something controversial and all of a sudden it's become social. So, uh, yeah, social? Yeah, it's become socialism. I'm actually being hit by three hammer bros. This is, this is what's happening today. Don't know where the last one is. No idea. Oh. Did I get that VR thing? No. I just looked at it and went, oh yeah, VR thing.
stealth. Stop it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh no! What's happening? Um. Yeah, that, that's um. That's that's not a bug. That's a feature. You can actually teleport your your enemies to the twelfth dimension, and, um, and and just and just kill them like that. That's yeah. That's how that's how that goes. Listen, Ryden, we're gonna have to forget we ever saw this, okay? And the last man in the box. So I was completely lying before. This is the best cutscene in the game. Interest. Anyone, anyone seen Wild Wild West? Just, just, you know, thinking. Saucy Jack. Just a little too late, as usual. I'm strong. Impressive little toy you've got there. But your plan ends here. <laughs> Idiot. You're not ending our plan. You're expanding it. Check the internet lately. Air Force One is turning back to the States. What? How'd they know? Someone posted photos of what's happening on the base. The whole world is up in arms. Show me. How did they? <laughs> Oops, we accidentally committed an international incident. A story leaked early. Then Marshall's plan is ruined. The hell it is. Look what they're saying. The story just went live, and already they're calling for blood. Pakistan is part of the axis of evil. But the president was saved. And yet American blood was spilled. 
by Americans. Besides, a few dozen soldiers is tragic, but nothing to start a major war over. That's just a spark, son. The excuse we've been waiting for. America's wanted this war for years. The Patriots, they knew war was good for the economy. Four years later, their legacy lingers on. The memes. The they memes. They left us their great isms. Nationalism. Unilateralism. Materialism. Welcome maxims for those with no faith. Without guiding principles of their own. Give yourself up to the whole. No need to better yourself. You're American. You're number one. Ooh. Then the only value left is dollar value. The economy. So we'll do whatever it takes to keep it humming along. Even war. Especially war. Bullshit. The Patriots planted the seed. We don't need them around to filter and foster their memes any longer. We're spreading them just fine ourselves. Every American man, woman, and child. We're all sons of the Patriots now. <coughs> we just need something to jumpstart the economy out of this funk. This recession this, this, has been this game since the is about kidnapping and murdering children and stealing their brains. <laughs> and the military costs? Wasting billions is going to help the economy? DMCs, arms manufacturers, job creators, Jack. All those workers spending money, paying taxes. Trust me, a little war can work wonders. So grease the gears with some innocent blood, is that it? Oh, relax, Jack. It's a war on terror. We're not out to kill civilians. Extremists, lawless gangs, madmen. <sighs> of course, that would have to include you. Wouldn't want any eyewitness reports complicating the message. Kind of got, kind of got the best theme tune. Yeah. This is genuinely my favourite song in the game. So it wouldn't, wouldn't be a Metal Gear game without a Metal Gear. So. Got a boss fight against Crabulon. That's right, I can parry this thing's foot. Why? Why not? Crab battle.
Oh, I forgot about this bit. The bit where they just feed you enemies. Look, how how was that ever not gonna hit them? He's just killing his own people on purpose. I suppose they are just drones, but even so. Like they're supposed to be on your side. You're the world's worst boss. Like not in terms of a boss fight, but in terms of an actual managerial position. Yeah, you know what this is just gonna get confusing. I'm at 0.1% health. I've just realised. I genuinely don't want to talk over the song. I just really like this song. Do you ever want to see someone suplex a giant crown? This is a very serious game about war and uh, organ harvesting. This is this is very very serious. I don't I don't know why you why you're laughing. I don't have to cut it up this much, I really don't. This implies Ryan's mass and force equal to that of the Metal Gear. Oh, he, he was too heavy for the helicopter earlier. I'm not saying he ate all the pies, but like... He's heavy. Get some crab Slippery sticks going. Bastard. I don't have time for this. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. That's right. 
The president just absorbed the power of the giant crab and is now really buff. That's what's happening right now. Let's go! The hell are you thinking? Ah! Played college ball, you know. That's a cushy Ivy League school. <laughs> All right, yeah, sorry, future president. Don't fuck with this, Senator. There, there's a crowd chip. This game is about child murder and what organ harvesting. <laughs> Why don't you stick around and find out? I don't I don't I don't, know, I don't know what to tell you. I could crush you with just one thing. The most iconic part is coming up. See, there's so many iconic parts that I just don't know which bit you're talking about. Oh, yeah, no, I know what you're talking about now. <laughs> Leave his chin alone. For like the third time. in this nation will control their own destiny. A land of the truly free, damn it. A nation of action, not words ruled by strength, not committee. Where the law changes to suit the individual, not the other way around. Where power and justice are back where they belong. In the hands of the people! Where every man is free to think, to act for himself. Fuck all these lunatic lawyers and chicken shit bureaucrats. Fuck this 24 7 internet spew of trivia and celebrity bullshit. American pride. Fuck the media. Fuck all of it. America's disease, rotten to the core. 
There's no saving it. We need to pull it out by the roots. <coughs> Wipe the slate clean. Burn it down! <coughs> and from the ashes, a new America will be born! Evolved, but unchanged! The weak will be purged. And the strongest will thrive. Free to live as they see fit. They'll make America great again! Oh no. What the hell are you talking about? This was like three years you or something before before Trump. It. So that's uh I'm using war ooh. as a business to get elected. <laughs> so I can end war as a business. <laughs> In my new America, people will die and kill for what they believe. Not for money, not for oil, not for what they're told is right. Every man will be free to fight his own wars. What do you think? Oh, how the hell did you get elected? <laughs> well, I don't write my own speeches. You should try fighting for what you believe in sometime, Jack. Not for a company or a nation or for anyone else. Maybe I was wrong about you. Am I finally getting through? I'll rid this world of pointless wars, Jack. I was wrong. You're not greedy. Shit insane! <laughs> I don't know if that's the iconic part you're talking about. That's definitely a good one. How's this this? Making the mother of all omelets here, Jack. Can't fret over every egg. Not when you're purging the leaf, right? What do you know about the weak? You weren't born poor. You've never been hungry. Oh, no, yeah. What it's like to fight and steal and kill just to survive. But you did survive. Through sheer force of will, following your own set of rules. With your own two hands, you took back your life. And now, I'll take yours. There's the bank flip. <laughs> uh, I was keeping track. Did do the back flip in the end. You know when the lid on a jar just won't break? It won't open, rather. It's just that.
Why won't you die? <laughs> Nano machines. They harden in response to physical trauma. You thought it was nonsense, but it was me. Nano machines. You can't hurt me, Jack. <laughs> what did I just say? think that little sword can save your master. <laughs> well, go ahead then. But make no mistake, Fido. When I'm finished with him, you're next. I can't believe I Senator Hulk Hogan is arguing with the robot dog. Huh? However, Directive 01 is to ensure all data acquired is preserved and passed along. To expire here would violate that directive. That's a good point. However, Raiden came to my aid. I have learned from him. When Samuel fell, data analysis was inconclusive. But that has changed. I have established new parameters now. Created my own directives. I mean, his theme song is you I'm My Own Master Now. So, yeah. All right. I was, I was going to let you live before that, but nope, nope, done now. Hands are tied, you kicked the dog. Of justice. Not used in anger. Not used for vengeance. But now, now I'm not so sure. And besides, this isn't my sword. Yeah, it's not, which means it doesn't have any of the enhancements I've put on it. Come on. Okay. Let's dance. 
which that actually makes it way weaker than my actual sword. But like, for storyline purposes it's stronger, so... Right, okay, the power goes, it just keeps going, I guess. Yeah, I don't know how the nano machines gave him lava powers, but they did. Doing step set. <laughs> that almost killed me. Damn it. need the, the repair nano <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, he can heal himself as well. So you gotta, you gotta put a stop to that, otherwise he'll... He, has, he gets 200% health because he's just unfair. So if you let him heal up, he will go all the way back to 200%. This game is about child murder and like people trafficking, by the way. Hey, do, do you get that uh, from from the boss? I, uh... Now punching him works because he's, I guess, angry enough. Yeah, I actually do need to go and get my sword now. Where are you? Sword, please. There we are. Because you can't actually block without a sword. It doesn't hit you. Oh, okay. That's just cheating. To be fair, this could just be called, well, that's just cheating, the boss fight. Because he gets every cheap ability you can think of, it's just that he, you know, he's pretty predictable.
It's not fun being on 0.1% health, is it? Thank God that one's more forgiving, because, oof. I got him. Okay, I didn't get him. Right, I think that got him. talking for a long time for a man who has my hand in his chest. I... Don't have a heart. Stop talking. And I. How? How appropriate, I got a B rank. Got a high frequency wooden sword, a high frequency Murasama, an infinite wig, like so many wigs, you would not believe how many wigs you can have. Family? But first, our top story. President Hamilton returns from Pakistan today, completing his first visit to the country since the failed assassination attempt in Shabazzbad last May. In meetings with Pakistani President Farooq Salam, the two leaders agreed to a new joint initiative in the War on Terror, whereby U.S. Marines will be stationed in Pakistan and given wider authority to conduct operations within the country. This is amidst growing tensions within Pakistan between the country's civil and military leadership, with many in the government calling on the ISI Military Intelligence Agency to be investigated. Unbelievable. After all that. For the last time, let it go, Courtney. At least Armstrong will never be president. But, I mean, Ryden. The 
there he is. I have excellent news. We are approved. The new corporation is established. Nice work, Doc. I guess the world's first cyborg staffing firm is officially open for business. We are certified for construction and long-term nursing care, but this is just the beginning. The potential for new roles cyborgs can play is limitless. And we're sure this isn't child labor? The older bra uh, No, because we now, said so. They come of age, and it's strictly voluntary, you know. We're not running a charity here, huh? <laughs> Donations alone would not even cover their maintenance. Besides, this way they'll learn a trade. Perhaps some discipline, huh? It's not a perfect solution. But you know what? At least these kids will get a decent education. Well, I'm not about to return them to the streets. Or to broken homes. At least we can give them a chance, <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oops. An imperfect solution for an imperfect world. Well, another benefit. A peaceful application for all my research. <laughs> <laughs> Since when do you care? Well, recent events have been food for thought, shall we say? No kidding. Speaking of recent events, how's our new recruit working out? Uh... Ah, yes, quite well. Quite well. Oi, Sunny! He's back. Hang on. Just give me one second. Yeah, okay. You make me head spin, you know? <clears throat> the same age as me, but all this spaceship? You're genius, girl. Mm -hmm. And you're hot for days. Huh? George is the worst. Where did that come from? <laughs> Alert. Alert. Release in there. White Wolf is the best boy. <laughs> this is about a crazy world, nah? <laughs> uh. For me, see that ninja. Me never think I've been this kind of life. Yeah. Huh? He rescued me too, you know saved my life. I owe him everything. To some people, he'll always be Jack the Ripper. I know all about his past. He had it rough. And he hurt a lot of people. Hmm. But that's not the Raiden I know. The right and I know is a hero. There you go, that's the end. You get, you get a, a nice atmospheric sword with lightning on it. Yeah, so I, I quite like this game. It's pretty good. Um, um, if, if that wasn't immediately obvious from the fact it's my, it was my go-to for game I can play. Eric Bowser. No relation, I assume. But I, it's my, my go-to game that I can play while still talking. Uh, it's, it's, it kind of got me into character action games, and like now I've spent like 400 hours in Devil May Cry, so what I'm saying is don't do it. It's a gateway drug. It's a bad idea. Don't, don't do it. Oh, oh well, the credits roll. I'm going to have a look at the... Uh see the stream make sure we're still doing all right <laughs> yeah. 
see how we're doing on the old donations because I haven't had a chance to check in the last six hours. We are at £310. That is not bad considering the first, uh, the first goal was 100 So, we're going to skip out on the DLC, I reckon, simply because, ooh, <laughs> I think we're, I think we're uh, Metal Geared out for, uh, for this stream. Uh, play, oh, I'm not playing full, guys. Uh, I'm going uh, to take a quick break, five, ten minutes, and uh, go to the bathroom, get, uh, get a quick snack. Refill my drink and uh, thinking uh, doing some Rome Total War. So, I'll keep that going until either the stream ends or I get bored. Ain't you could not pay me enough to play Resident Evil. You don't get breaks. I get whatever breaks I say. Eat yourself. I have tried. Turns out I don't taste great. Sort of just tastes like a person. Not a fan. The other side, I've been there. Uh, I've been literally sat down. Uh, Liam, not in public. God. Yeah, I've, been, I've literally been sat down since uh, since eight o'clock this morning, so I'm gonna just take five minutes. And then we'll add it to the end, shall we? I already owe five minutes for uh, for the stream going down. So, so I'll keep a tally. I think that's ten past eight now. Due to finish. people worked on this game. Like, sometimes you see credits and they go for like two minutes and it's like, yeah, okay, fair enough. Sometimes these things go on forever. <laughs> we'll finish the game, we haven't finished the stream. You're, you're in time, you're, we're just gonna have a, a quick break and then I'm gonna come back and uh, play some Rome Total War. Right. It's your own fault, Bernard. You've got to be less popular. <laughs> How long is one one hundred and seventy six million eight hundred and sixty seven four hundred and fifty six seconds? Eight hundred and sixty-seven thousand, rather. Uh, 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 more than five minutes, I'm fairly certain. Uh, I, have, I have no idea, Liam. How long is that? I'm not playing Dino Crisis. <laughs> I have no capability to play Dino Crisis. I was not expecting you to try and work it out. I, well then what? <laughs> I don't get this joke. You, you've confused me. Not that that takes much.
410 billion dead dinos. There could be. We don't know. I don't know how many dinosaurs there were. I haven't asked them. There could be easily that many dinosaurs. Developed by Platinum Games. Love Platinum Games. If you're, ever, if you're ever at a loss for something to play, look up anything by Platinum Games. They're pretty consistently amazing. Apart from the licensed stuff for uh, Transformers and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, that was not as good. And how's business? Oh, good, good. The Herb Doctor's research and staffing service certainly help. I hear World Marshal's looking for a buyer. <laughs> well, you cost them a lot of money, no? Not to mention killing their funding. Literally. <laughs> now, the bread-taking program is finished, but the larger company is not, I'm afraid. Uh, someone will buy them. PMCs are in demand once again. Yeah. Fighting for reasons they don't understand. Causes they don't believe in. Big pardon? No. Nothing. So, your mind is made? You will not come back. Sorry, Boris. I understand. But then, what will you do? <laughs> I've got my own war to fight. Yeah, this is a, a set, set up for Metal Gear Rising Revengeance 2. Um, I'm sure it'll be announced just any day now. Give, give, me, give it a bit, you know. It's only been, what, eight years. Revengeance! <laughs> Bees across them, everything B, nothing but bees. It's all B. What well, it was all B, it always has been. It's bees all the way down. This is this is Metal Gear Rising B Vengeance. Oh wow, completed normal difficulty in less than eight hours. Complete normal while earning more than 300,000 BP. Only using the high frequency blade, yeah, I guess. That tested. B. 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 It's, oh, it's all Bs. Nothing on there is your hard because I haven't, I haven't played that. I put something in new save file for this. I say starting a new save file, my old one it wasn't there, so <laughs> Right, so we're gonna have a bit of a break. We'll reconvene at let's say at three o'clock, shall we? And then uh we'll jump over. I'll catch you guys in a little bit.
It's me. I'm back. Oh. Ready for a, a sudden departure from all music. Oh, it's gone. There it goes. Right. This is a smooth transition, obviously. Um, I'm very professional. I, d I don't know who. I'm just someone. I just appear as if by magic. Now let's see if it wants to play ball. Right, looks like that's getting picked up. Uh, assuming you can all hear what's going on. So I did uh, use this for a test stream. So I've got to figure out exactly what level the audio should be at. I think that's about okay. If it's uh, if it's all all right on uh, on your end, give me a B. See, now I have to wait for like bees to appear. If no bees appear, then I'm like, oh, don't know what to do. I'm just going to roll with it and assume that everyone can uh, can hear what's happening. So I've played a little bit of this is easy. Take up to medium. Yeah. So I played a little bit of this. Plays the Skippy Eye, and the only thing I managed to do was unlock the Greeks. And I mean, why would you not? So uh, we're gonna we're gonna place the Greeks, because why not? Oh, actually, should it? No, we're just gonna place the Greeks. So like, <laughs> so like, uh, I think we've got enough advice. Nothing left to conquer. The world was his. But Alexander. 
Alexander is dead. His empire is gone. His soul living. They are meant to fight carnage. You are, you are correct. But guess what? If you take, I think it's Apollonia. Like you essentially neuter the uh, the Bruti High. So I always end up just sending some people over to there. And you can usually have a pretty good foothold in Greece. The fate still spinning the web of men before uh, before the Bruti I can even get in there, and it basically just so kneecaps them. So when you get to the, the um, to be great again. when perhaps you get to the civil war, they are not a threat, which is useful because the Bruti I are chaos. true to the name but brutal. The otherwise, to a better plan. perhaps I still managed to to take out Carthage. It, Spread me a bit thin, but uh, wasn't, wasn't too bad. I would say if anyone uh, sees this game and thinks, build a Trojan horse. I don't believe there are Trojan horses. I think also it's a, it's like a, a, a few thousand years too late. <laughs> so, God, the Greeks really do start off with a my lord. Not a lot. No alerts. That's fine then. No news. No reports. That's fine. We haven't got any like first turn things to worry about. Yes, master. Uh Yes, Stratagos. Right. So, first order of business. Oh god. Pergamum up there as well. So what roads, I suppose? Ships ready. We need to do something about this. So usually in I forgot I for, forgot you got Syracuse as well. The Greeks are pretty spread out, so you kind of need to ready. Use the. Uh, the navy pretty wisely. Can not have to get Cadonia, but it's unlikely that we'll be able to get any decent armies over there just yet. Uh, what's our capital at the minute? Is it Pergamon? I would assume so. Or I assume it's Sparta. Yeah. Uh, in that course. So you are. Let, let's start calm, shall we? And build up our settlements a bit. Uh, Thinking we go with Hermes. Uh, maybe try and get a bit of a uh, bit of trade going out of Rhodes. Cause it's probably our most defensible area at the minute. If we can build it up a bit, my lord. Um, let's go check on Athens. Oh wow. Like three kingdoms I like a lot. Like and admittedly I'm just a fan of the era. 
more than anything, but it, it does have a lot of really interesting stuff. Like, it's a, it's a total war game where you don't actually have to declare war. So, it's, uh, like, you can just, you can win that game entirely through, like, just diplomacy and trade and that kind of thing. Which is, which is kind of unique. Uh, I think... Because we can't... Ideally, we'd attack Athens. But... My only decent army is in Sparta. And I'd have to get through Corinth. Yeah, I, I just said you can do it. I didn't say you should. So I could send some troops from here. Cretan archers. Gotta love Cretan archers. Cretan archers with experience as well. Tell you what, we'll build up a couple of units here. Oh, we've got peltasts. We've got peltasts. That's it. Oh, wow. Thurman. Oops, uh, Oh, but it also needs defences. Yeah, we're going to have to hold off on attacking Athens for a couple of turns while we get some decent troops. Your Honor. Uh, why are you going there? Curious. What's it? Why are you why are you obsessed with going to Halicarnassus? Like, who really really wants to go there? Is that like your holiday home? What's going on? So benefits of being of being Greek. Uh, we do start with the Colossus of Rhodes, which gives us plus 40 naval trade. So, <laughs> the the, uh, the world wonders you find around here are so broken. What was the Roman Empire cut in half by? The Emperor. Okay. Okay, I, I sit... Mm. Yes, Bernard. Oh dear. I shall speak with them at once. I'm going to convince the Skippy Eye not to attack me. Uh, no, you're not going to accept an alliance. A most generous proposal. I could buy Mercs, but I'm I'm already not doing great in the economy. I'm hoping that the fact that I do get so much sort of trade boost is going to mean they'll think twice about attacking Syracuse. Because otherwise, <laughs> oh boy, are we not going to hold on to that for long? I've, I've got the bigger army, but it's not a great army. Hmm. What have we got here? Peltas. You know, if I... my lord, I'm going to get these guys moving. I'll buy some mercs if I can afford... 850 though, for one unit. It's not really worth it. They've... I think I've got enough units to take it, uh, Athens as it is. It's, uh... Worst case scenario, I'll just sit like 400 miles away and let the Cretan archers just range them. We'll have to keep an eye on Macedonia. I'm trying to remember where all of our territory is now. Uh, Syracuse. We should get some building going. 
Odin. Oh no. Um, keep trade income going. Why is the ancient version of the countdown theme playing? You tell me. I didn't. I didn't write it. Did you write the countdown theme? Stick with shrines to Hermes, I'm thinking. Oh god, Pergamum's really going to get just nothing at the end of all this. Uh, I'll pick up any of mine later. Because it's so isolated, this is kind of where I'm worried about most at the minute. It's our soft underbelly. Um, let's get a trader going. Flexible income in the capitals would be pretty handy. Yeah, we are out of money. How are we going to be next turn? Uh, We'll be fine. Three thousand. Right. I prefer to be able to have a fight on the first uh, on the first turn, but it looks like it's not giving us the chance. Oh, it looks like they're all moving on Athens. Blocking me. You gotta be like that, haven't you? Ready to sail. I don't know anything with the fleet now. Oh, that's annoying. My lord, what is so 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 what is Because if Macedon lays siege, then they'll get it when we attack. So I'd prefer not to do that because I don't want to start a war with Macedon right away. I'll build up a little bit. We could just ignore it, like leave Athens and go and take out the Carnassus, get the, uh, the mausoleum. Reduces building construction times by 20%. So always nice, but it's not vital. I'd rather get Athens because it gets you loads of money. Uh, get some mine. Oh wait, no, that's like two grand. Just had a look. Let's not do that. Let's get them all. Yeah, we... I can't think of any time in which the Greeks and the Macedonians have ever had any sort of... Oh, hang on a minute. It's just all of time, isn't it, to be honest. Uh, blacksmith would be good, but probably not here. Get some farmland going. Fine, Syracuse, got that. My lord. Oh, right. My lord, investigate. How did that go? Right, he's not going to attack with that, is he? This is too, it's two hoplites. So I should have a turn to for him to just bugger off and to move in on Athens. We've become the most advanced faction somehow. I guess I guess I did build a wall. So you know, there's that. 
Rhodes and Pergamum. We've already added stuff to that, haven't we? Yeah, Rhodes. End of term report. We're, uh, we're down a bit. Be of service, yes, my lord. Yes, master. Huh. I thought Arthur started with Nicomedia. Well, that shows what I know. It's been a, been a while since I've played this one. Not gonna lie. Or we're thinking of Pontus. Either way, I thought I thought an actual faction had uh, Nicomedia at the start of the game. Get him to port at Rhodes for now. We'll figure out what to do with the, uh, the old fleet as we, uh, as we move on. Oh good, there's the skippy eye. <laughs> Apparently they just don't care about the whole trading thing. They act... You bastard. That's it, it's, ba it's basically all Greece. It's Greece, more Greece. Turkey, Greece. Right, if we can't take Athens. My Lord. I'm thinking, well we go back to Thurman, because why not. I'm thinking we move up and maybe cut off the Brutii a bit. Because if they can't get a foothold, then that's going to save us a lot of effort later. You're gonna need troops, aren't you? We got, we got hoplites. We can build hoplites. There's that. Uh, so you know what? You're not gonna have three turns. No, you're not gonna have a chance. Settlement besieged by oh, oh, they're experienced as well. Why would you do such a thing? What did I ever do to you, Quintus? Oh good, the entirety of Rome hates me. Oh, I guess. I'll be honest, if we, if we lose Syracuse, it's kind of to be expected. Uh, I, I would prefer not to, especially because I've got a general there and it's my faction air. But like, it, if I do, there's not much that can be done about it because I'm not going to reinvade Sicily. So... All I can really do is just take it on the chin and try and outflank Macedonia a bit more. I'll tell you what, thinking on it. Why don't I get some recruiting going on in Sparta? So I get actual hoplites to start off with. That's pretty handy. Ah, Seleucids. <laughs> the uh, the famously survivable nation. Absolutely never an issue there. I, I can't wait for the uh, the many years of Seleucid just dominance. They will, they will just go on forever. So, spoiler alert: they will they will not go on forever. They are not long for this world. I'd laugh if they lost the fight and couldn't take Athens. Uh, we're building that up. 
farm, that's fine. Still doing community farming. Wall could, is going to be built next turn, so mm -hmm. let's... Tempted to go for the population boost just so that we can uh, I'll tell you what, ignore all of it, we're gonna get some mines. Get that money. All about the money. That's what I forgot to do. Forgot my uh I shall speak with them at once. I shall speak with them at once. At once. I shall speak with them at once. Oh no, they're not going to come and help me. <laughs> oh no. Dog money? Exactly. No. There we go. Trade some map information. Would you consider? Why would I... Yeah, all right. I'm okay. going to take that, just because it's going to uh, the trade rights are going to earn me more money with Carthage than uh, I would lose I shall from speak that. With them at once. So why not? Are you are you committing to this? Because this I'm not sure if this is a bug of the remaster, but occasionally enemy army will just attack, but then let go and attack again, so it resets the counter for how long you can hold out, which is a curious decision. <laughs> now, now Brutei Eye doesn't like us. on a minute. Oh, the mm, Macedon's kind of forcing my hand here. Especially with Corinth sitting there so undefended. Alright, well, if I can't Can't uh, attack the rebels. I guess we're going for Macedon. Uh, uh, Pergamum. Let me get some recruitment going on here. A couple of hot plates will do. Oh wow, peasants. Yeah, you, yes, you guys can stay yes, here. Stratigos. Experienced peasants, though. Spartan hot points. Yeah. Get your elephants over those mountains. That's the, that's the wrong side of the, uh, the Mediterranean, Dave. Besieging settlements, sir! 
sort of Carthaginians you're thinking of. Besieging settlement, sir. Ready to sail. Do I move? Yeah. Sir, yes, strat yes, Stratigos. I think we move Forward. this army up here. So if these guys do break off their siege and attack, they're more likely to attack this guy than they are yes, this army. So. Awaiting your command. I also, shall speak please to give me money. <laughs> A most generous proposal. Cool. Getting more and more of that trade in. further east and try and get some more trade rights because it's going to be just Seleucids for a little while. I wonder if I, I should bribe Halicarnas. Well. Well. Be quick. Our patience is limited. You insult us. No. Nope. <laughs> that would be convenient. Because that would get us some construction speed. You never know, we might be able to uh, to get him to open the door. It seems unlikely, but it could happen. Right. I'd say there's nothing more we can do this time. Be quick. Our patience is limited. Hey, would you like a ceasefire? It's not going to happen. Uh, can I bribe you? You insult us. Nope. Are you sponsored for this endeavor? No. Uh, <laughs> very, very specifically, no. But you know, if you were to to donate to the uh, the Stroke Association, then that would be a. Uh, That'll be a good time for everyone involved. <laughs> Units can hide in forest. Background is a picture of the desert. Okay. Crazy. They ported this game to phones. Like not the remaster, but like the ferryman will be original. busy today. He will take many souls to the afterlife. Just make sure that yours is not one of them. What a speech. Free men! Proud children of Greece! Prepare to fight for your honor! Right, 
Right, I need to figure out who's on the walls, because... Uh, Archer's be nice, but hoplites are useless on the walls. They will just get overwhelmed. They're better on the ground, where you can get them in a phalanx. Uh, have we got anything back here defending? No. Right. So, they have one set of ladders and a ram. I'm gonna stick. Yeah, if I leave the archers and the peltasts on here, they should. I assume that the Hastati are gonna lay their ladders along this wall because they're on this side, and the AI is uh, pretty simple like that. If I can stop them from getting up, then that just leaves the ram, which we can repair for. With help lights. Move, move, hop lights. Move, 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 hop like militia. Go, go, hurry. Well, it's not a great plan, but it's the best I've got. It is to be going well so far. What's happened to you? Oh, I, I know why. It's because of starvation, their morale, and the numbers are a little low. Take no prisoners. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have that option. Use fire. Probably better to use flaming arrows. Don't skirmish. Do not skirmish. Luckily, we're hitting them... Right, Rome Total War is amazing. Because we're hitting them at an angle where their shields are facing the other way, we'll do more damage. No, stop doing that. Attack these ones. Wait, no, do not act. I'm completely wrong. What am I talking about? I can destroy their ram. <laughs> the ram's on fire. Please actually shoot at any point. Please, guys, what are you doing? There we go. In, uh, in melee. The ladders have reached the walls, but the enemy have to yeah. still get inside the center. Uh, not great, but they might be able to survive a little bit. We're gonna have to Quickly. send some hot pipes up to support them. Oh God, archers! What are you doing? Step arches, please. Oh no. Oh, you know what? Cut our losses. Uh, have the Peltas cover the retreat and, uh, we should be able to have the archers fire up at them. And you do get a debuff from being lower than the uh, the enemy. But we're using flaming arrows and really all we're just doing is wearing them down. So that's, that's the priority here.
We are technically winning by like. No, no, we've lost. No, there's there's our one percent. Now, the one thing I don't miss about Rome Total War, you have to get all of your people down before you can tell them to go anywhere. See, if we can get a, one or two of them to break, we might be able... It's unlikely, but we might be able to get the rest to just give up, essentially. Victory seems certain. You're on fire! How is victory certain? I mean, you are fighting Peltas, but like... I keep a real Grammy. I mean, I imagine that you do not, but I would say that your PC would probably require some RAM. Uh, such as the kind this game needs in order to run. You see, it's funny because... Uh, RAM actually means something else. Ooh. Okay, that this this is not working. Uh, I think they might just take the gate. If they take the gate, then we're really in a bad place because they will be able to just walk on through with basically everything they've got. To the first Astarte die. I think they all died. <laughs> Somehow we managed to stop a unit of Astarte. Oh, well, there go the Peltas. They were nice while they lasted. Oh, and their shields are on this side, so it's going to deflect off those. All Look that. to the inner defenses. The walls have fallen to the enemy, and the gods have abandoned us. Yep, this is bad, because now. <laughs> Our own towers are going to start shooting us. Oh, they're broken. If I, I might be able to retake the gate. That means if these guys can get up and take the gate back. It'll lock these guys out, and what whoever's left in will be stuck in. Why are you breaking formation? Literally, the one thing you're good at. Please stop shooting our men in the back. We've taken the the gate back. We've like, oh no, oh no. Oh, these hoplites are taking a batter in there. Just trying to kill these like three soldiers that are just parked up here. How many are there? Eight. There are eight of them and they're destroying my hotlights. How, is the, how have they got the gates? How does that make sense? Right, uh... Oh, 
Right, we might have time to get them information on the wall. Right, hop lights don't work greatly, like great on the wall because they're. I mean, usually to beat a hop light, all you do is you flank it, but it, it you can't flank it on the wall. But the hop lights also can't get in a proper formation, like so. Anyone care to, uh, you know, shut the door? You think um, that's a good idea, or...? Archie. These archers are owning their keep as well. And still shooting people. Building captured, building lost, building captured, building lost. Who's got it at the minute? We do. That's fine then. They are still taking damage. And when they they are only light infantry, so Yeah, that's that's the plan, flanking like, from the other tower, but it's uh Oh no! <laughs> Here comes the general. I was about to say these guys are only light infantry, so if they uh, if they do get in like down here, they will have to fight heavy cavalry. But they might be busy. What? Why are you facing the other way? What idiots! Oh no, this has gone horribly. Oh, it's going brilliantly until my phalanx decided to just go in the other direction. Get back in position. Still, I am drawing them back up here because there are hot lights here now. General is running away. This is no way oh, for a leader to We got him. We got battle, him. He's dead. Belief. The enemy general is slain, and now his men fear us. It is time to press the attack. Oh, that's so. We might. We. I think we've won this. Our soldiers are a bit crap, but they're they're kind of the way I'm having to use them is kind of not how they're meant to be used. Like, the Peltas to ranged. I, they're, they're not meant to stand and fight, but I kind of had to have them do it, because, like, the only other thing I, I had were hoplites and archers. I don't know where the general's going. Yeah. These guys just appear to be charging the... Uh, the sheer drop, which is a curious decision. Now let's take this uh, this gateway back, so we we're not still being shot by our own towers. Oh, they are done. Where's? Uh what else have they got left? Nothing. Their generals going. Once these guys die, they're done. And it's the last guy. Oh no. The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are I can't believe we managed to hold that. You. The enemy are crushed! Your victory is complete! They have 31 soldiers remaining. We have 200. How? And we even we even healed thirty nine peltasts, you know, the ones that were wiped out. How? How? They got no casualties back. That's crazy.
Like, we should not have been able to win that. Really quite lucky. <laughs> Put the horses on the wall. Give the horses bows and arrows. Like, I... I, I genuinely, the only reason we won that was because of the archers. So I'm like... Ooh. Looks like Carthage is making a move on Masana. Because if they take that, I don't have to worry about the Skippy. Like, they won't be able to expand at all. They're very, like, the AI is very bad at naval invasions. Even in the uh, three masters. So they will never take that back. Oh, okay, so they didn't... Captain Argios. What is... I could probably take Larissa. Let's focus on Corinth first. Yeah, I would have thought they'd have come to try and relieve Corinth, considering when we take it we get the Statue of Zeus. Which, uh, it's not amazing. It gives us plus four like bonus to population loyalty but it's still a still a world wonder still good to have uh, well, well read this first coming of age Cleon of Sparta Oh, in in Syracuse. So we've now got uh, another general there. That will basically mean that we're safe there for a little while. We are we are good. Most of oh no oh hang on a minute. Macedon have gone and become the most advanced faction. That was our thing. Dionysus, Di Di I'm not going to, Dio of Sparta has got a uh, good commander, that's handy. And turn report, we're doing alright on money. We do need to build more in roads and thermon though. Um, let's keep the uh, Temple of Hermes going. That's that one. Ooh, could go for a port, but honestly I'm thinking roads, ironically. Uh, we've got a lot of things going on there, Pergamum, we're going to have, have mines done next turn, which is going to be really handy for our finances. Sparta doesn't have anything training at the minute. Let's get some hop lights going. What is? Ooh, Thurman's a bit low on the old uh, happiness front. What is? Sir. What is? Sieging settlement, sir. Uh, we only got time for one. Sieging settlement, sir. Sir. What are those sick beats? I don't know. This is the uh, the Rome Total War soundtrack. I'm sure you'll be able to uh, to find that. It's maybe they're all composed for the uh, for the game. So all they've got is the general and some archers. Can you, can you fight a night battle? Yes. That will actually be pretty handy. You are 58 though, <laughs> so I don't expect to have you for very much longer. Is it on Spotify? It actually might be. Uh, I haven't checked. Do you beatbox? Uh, no. No. Does that answer your question? No. 
No, I do not. No. Moving on. Tonight we will feast and drink. Tonight we will tell each other tales of our bravery. But before that, we must beat our foes and show them why we are the heirs of Alexander and Achilles. Take up the sword! Look to your arms and armor! Now comes the hour when we test Greek courage! Alright. I'd say we don't don't really need to wait. So we're attacking at night, so. We should have the advantage because their archers are not going to have as long sight lines. Uh, but just to. I wish I had something better than hoplites to put on the thing. Oh well. I absolutely should not put <laughs> Spartan hoplites on the on the ladders. Mo, Mo, stand it for me. Mo, Mo, run. Hoist the ladders. There we go. Yeah, these are these are our special guys. We do not want them getting mixed up on the walls because they will. They are far too important for that. Only take prisoners that promise to invest in Dogecoin. I mean, it's uh, it's how you can tell that they're reasonable. Let's move these up. Units, uh, units, double time. Ram. They don't appear to have put their archers on the wall, which is a curious decision. No, they've they've put them all on the center. I, I mean, I, I suppose, but like, I have a whole bunch of hoplites. <laughs> like that's where I excel. Oh, please don't destroy my ram. That'll be really annoying. Now oh, the ram seems to be taking that again. Okay. I think those arrows look flaming, but they're not actually flaming. Like, flaming arrows are an actual ability that genuinely set things on fire. No, the ram is actually on fire. Okay then, retreat, pull back. That's fine, I didn't like that ram anyway. a bit of wall yeah. really curious what their uh, their strategy is going to be here our ladders are at the walls now bravery and steel will be tested as our men fight over the defences oh yeah we're going to fight over the defences against uh I don't know, I think people forgot to turn up. There's, uh... Uh... Anyone home? Anyone? Oh, we've taken the gateway, so that's, um... Great gods! Our soldiers have done well this day. The walls are taken. Quickly. Hoplite. Mo, Mo. Now here's a goddamn beat. Look at this.
Get that on your Spotify playlist. That was a close one, yeah. Oh, tough, tough fight there. I'm gonna take the gates on either side. Go, go, go! These guys move up the centre. You want to take the towers and the gates and sort of close in on all sides from these guys because I really, really do not want to uh, to mess it up and just lose a whole bunch of pop plates. They're not cheap. I feel like I'm being... What? I, I don't know... I don't know what you're saying didn't work, Dave. I'm worried. Have you spotted something I have? No, not related to your tactic. What's uh, what's not working? What's going on? Quickly! Tell if they're trying to attack me or avoid me. Ready, pop light. Quickly. Form my 
phalanx. Oh, they appear to be going to attack me. Which is a curious choice. So they shouldn't chase or anything like that. Pop lights. Pop lights. You could, they just ran into the phalanx. What's wrong with you people? Do you just not like being alive? What's happening? All right, well. Oh no, oh, I think they've broken the phalanx a little bit. Oh, that's bad. I, I took out a massive wave of them at the start, but I didn't get the general, which I kind of need to do to get them to give up. So if, even at this point, they should be able to hold a little bit, at least for the other phalanx to get there. Ready, now. Who the hell is shooting? Oh. They're getting in range of our towers, because <laughs> we took their gatehouse. What? What idiots? Maybe if I pull back a bit. I can get them fully in range. Oh, oh no! <laughs> They're charging into the gates! Oh, if these guys had a brain, they'd be dangerous. Oh no, that's a. Oh, you're not. This one's too deep, mate. You're not gonna charge in the. It's literally just the general left. Right? It's the only one. Left. Just someone, just, just kill him. Just. You've got spears. There the we go. The general is slain, and now his men fear us. It is there time to go. press the attack. Just. Just. Do the attacking. No. They, they try, they're trying to shoot us at point blank range while we're in a phalanx. I don't know if you know how shields work, but um, this, is, this is not your best bet. <laughs> Hearts are full of fear, and now they flee. Uh, we'll keep, we'll keep them going because I believe you get extra experience for just letting these guys run wild for a bit. Uh, speed it up a bit. <laughs> oh, that's uh. That's just comedy gold this is a there. Victory. Well, Clear victory. We lost about 96 people. But they lost all of theirs. So we did we did lose a lot of hoplites, sadly. I would have preferred not to, but well, one unit of hoplites I think is worth Corinth, so <laughs> I'll take it. The statue of Zeus at Olympia. It, 
it it did didn't exist. Just just gonna say, it it didn't it didn't exist. What is? This pie failed to open the gate. Thanks. Right, we need. But apparently, I have nothing to repair. Everything was, everything's fine. Alright, so there's absolutely no infrastructure, though. I really need uh, blood lights training. A couple of hell tasks, why not? roads doing. Still getting up there. Still getting up there. My lord? I should wonder if they'll accept a cease Be quick. Our patience is limited. Surely you jest. Nah. <laughs> I shall speak with them at once. Will you take an alliance? No. Well, see you later. Yes, master. Where's my other, uh, my other diplomat? Awaiting your command. So yeah, let's get him yes, back master. to Permanum. Permanum? Pergamum. Uh, people are a bit happier now that we're, you know, winning the war. <laughs> Total War Diplomacy is more of a cosmetic feature, kind of, yeah. It has Can been, be of service? it has been better late in, uh, like, later or more recent, um, editions, but they have retooled it in this, so it does actually, you know, do things, so you can set up trade, like, embargoes if you want to, and there's merchants you can set up and things like that. It really doesn't do it that much. <laughs> you, you still can't like use it like you can in three kingdoms to just completely overwhelm people with money but or just supply everyone's food and become immortal because no one wants to kill you because you have all the food uh, yeah, cool that. Ooh, macedon are attacking us How curious Can't fight a night battle, sadly, because they're attacking us. Uh, light cavalry and heavy cavalry. This is not a good idea. Um, okay. Uh, if you if you want to attack us, let's do it. Let's. I mean, I have hoplites. Man arrested for training dog to throw bricks at people ringing his doorbell. It's a good dog. Oh right, yeah, they're sallying forth. That's a... Oh my god, they lost in a straight up fight to Peltasts. Light cavalry, this game. It's uh it's not what you'd call reliable. 
Can I, if I can take out their general, they're basically done in terms of the siege. So we can pen him in. Your general has thrown away his life and now feeds oh, right. the Our general birds. ends up dying. These men may soon be bird feed too. Thanks, whatever your name was. Oh I forgot now the hot plates are breaking. Because of course they are. Oh, this for a second this looked like it might work, and then the general went and just died. Now all we can hope is that maybe, maybe we could also kill their general, and that will make whatever army I send after these guys able to take it a little bit more easily. Oh no, no, we're uh, we're fleeing, right? Well, this has backfired spectacularly. Don't kill my Cretans, damn it. This is you a have dark been defeated, day. yeah. Even I'm aware. the staunchest efforts of our soldiers were not enough for victory. Antigonos. Yeah. From now on, Antigonos will be known as George. George of Sparta. Living the army. Okay, Carthage just appears to have given up and be going home. But... Hey, Pontus. Greetings. Trade rights. But, can I have map information? A most generous proposal. It's not a heroic death. He went out like a bitch. We're the most advanced faction again. Uh, Pergamum. Need some people to train. Let's get some hot lights going. Then we've got Peltas. Syracuse has hot lights. End of turn, we're still making money. Pergamum has got mines going now. So, that is something else to build. We could build even more mines. Seems a bit unnecessary. Uh, I'm thinking roads. They're cheap and they get you a decent amount of cash. So, If in doubt, build some roads. Uh, I'm going to go for a Temple of Nike here. Oh, the Cretans survived. That's good. Uh, that being said, we don't have an awful lot of family, which is kind of an issue. Uh, got Memnon of Sparta. Because we, we could really do with a governor to take over uh, Thurman. Now that Antigonos has gone and thrown himself on a goddamn spear. Ah, oh, there we go. Pontus gone and taken the comedian. Yes, I always thought that they had it at the start. This shows what I know. I reckon they're uh, 
They're willing to, to give me trade rights. Be again. quick. Our patience is limited. No. Do you want a ceasefire yet? No. I'll see you later. Yes, master. doing here in terms of retraining we're not because we don't really have the facilities to do it wonderful could send them back to Sparta for retraining but that's that would get them extra uh, extra experience because you get more experience if you retrain in an area with uh, the blacksmith or uh, temple that gives extra experience but other than that action announcement we've got a new new family member Memnor of Sparta as a wise man oh good Macedon has signed peace with uh, or an alliance with Thrace who are sort of around here-ish which is bad because if they were, if they had any problems before, they might have had troops stationed up there that they're going to bring back down south now. They are really piling on Athens. I do not want that to fall. Oh no! <laughs> it's this guy again. Oh. We are not in a good. Stop taking my... Yeah. Right. We're going to have to... Leave the injured here. And... Uh, Move our army to go and defend Thurman. Because if they take that, then we're kind of just stuck in a bottleneck. We really do not want that. Tell you what, I am going to quit waiting around Sir. here. Hang on, are we still retraining here? Sort of. My Lord. I'm going to send a 17 year old. Because, you know, when, uh, when in doubt, send a teenager. I've seen anime. I know how this goes. Oh, but if I don't send. Yeah, we'll send. We'll send the, uh, the archers. Yeah. Besieging settlement, sir. Besieging settlement, sir. Oh, they have war dogs. So that's uh That's an easy win. You can get actual hoplites training. Send George. But George is dead. That's why he's George. That's why I have called him George, because he just died trying to defend against a Sally and Larissa. Uh, Sparta has nothing building. Let's build something then. Walls. Oh, uh, yeah, let's get that going because we could build armored hot pipes. Roads. Gotta get blacksmith. Uh, now let's get some uh, some roads built. Build some roads in roads. Build a port in Pergamum, I can do with that. And there's a shrine to Nike. Let's keep that going. Uh, Syracuse.
actually, you know what? Uh, get away with training Peltas, because we need to get those archers back up to speed pretty soon. Archers, kind of what we relied on to hold Syracuse. If we can't, then it's... Uh... Oh yeah, we can retrain the peasants. Hooray. So, we're going to get attacked next turn. There's no way of avoiding that. Cause, I mean, he's, just, he's right there. But we might be able to scare him off with uh, with both armies there. Ready. Mm, yeah, I'd say that's everything. Oh, <laughs> the Skippy Eye of Sally. That's two. I mean, that's one way. Uh, I've been said, that's what I said last time. And then, all I'm saying is if. Wow! That is a hell of a face for a 17 year old. Uh. Hmm. Right. Let's, uh. Let's take care of the Skippy Eyes, but if if they if they attack, we can just pop our. Uh, or if they rush out, we can pop our um, our hoplites in front, stick the archers at the back, and just watch them melt. I'm really curious as to why, because all they've got is cavalry and war dogs, and war dogs essentially, like they can do some damage, but they're not gonna take down heavy units like hoplites. Ram. Drop the ram. Move, move. Militia hoplites. Militia hoplites. 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 Yeah, they appear to just be running out to meet us? Why? I'm very curious as to where they, this guy thinks it's going. Is he, is he just leaving? Is that his, is that his plan? To just leave? Or to flank us? Yeah. He's trying to Pop flank lights. us. Pop lights. Make ready. Unit A. Units, double time. Archie, attack! Hoplite! Move, move! Kill them! Militia hoplites! Attack! Attack! Hoplite! Alright, just send everything at them then, I guess. Oh, okay, that was clever. Damn, they actually used some strategy and that surprised me. Oh no, we're gonna lose twi twice in a row. That's just embarrassing. Right. Take out the war dogs handlers because that will mean that the actual war dogs will. Oh, oh no! The Paw Patrol got legit. <laughs> Kill them. Oh no! We don't want to get caught in a head-to-head -head with. Roman cavalry because they are much stronger than us. I need to retreat. Yeah, 
Here's the one problem. Can't actually remember the uh, the button for <laughs> for fleeing. Uh, a defeat. Well, <laughs> this is going about as well as expected. Something has just occurred to me. Sound the retreat. That's fine. The siege is broken. Looks like an old Gallagher. We are not in a good position. He's 17 years old. I mean, I, he might be dead now. I mean. Now he's alive. He survived. Cleon of Sparta. It does sort of look like Noel Gallagher. You're not wrong. Yes, right. Them. Now, they cannot attack Thermon without attacking my... Uh, my army there, which uh, we'll see, I suppose. Uh, really need troops training here. Yeah, I just can't remember where the uh, the white flag is now. Because they changed all the UI from uh, the original. Well, at the very least, they might be distracted by Carthage for a bit. Nice if there was uh, if there were Cretan archers, but I th think uh, I think not. That's a shame. Ready. Right, let's get something building on here. Save roads, why not? Keep it going. Oh. I'm not having the best of luck in this game. Hooray, at least our boats are doing well. Only because I'm not commanding them. Yeah, they use the best defense of um, of 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 me forgetting that the AI actually works now. It seems like every time I go for a siege, I get sent on out on the uh, on the sally, which is a shame. Oh, they found a spy. I think besiege them again. Either that, or it just sends a notification every turn now, because it seems to happen a lot.
Right, that's working again. Okay, that was interesting. Everything just went flickery. It's fine. Stream stream is working fine. Don't know what you're talking about. It's all fine. Uh, let me train those, I guess. Make sure OBS, yeah, it's fine. Still need construction in Pergamon. Uh, let's get a blacksmith going. Blacksmiths are pretty handy. Hoplites, but honestly, we've got enough hoplites. The problem is that they're just not very effective in open fields. got a good chance but Rome's always hard to fight because their uh, they, their units are just better than most others it's uh, especially especially when the Marian reforms come around oh god <laughs> then then the, you, you just get the destroyed last, there is something appealing Something appalling! Something for everyone in what I must now say! We will win! Many of us may die, but all of us will be brave! I don't know why. I hear that and I and I think the phrase Some of you there may no die, shame in being but that scared, is a sacrifice I am willing to make. Never be your master. Now cheer, you children of Zeus, and sound the advance! Yes, yes I did just quote Shrek. Fight me. Oh, well, we've got the high ground at least. <laughs> voice act. I don't think they actually updated the voice acting from the original. I think that's all the way back from, what, 2004? So it's uh, it's definitely stood the test of time. God be praised! The reinforcements are oh, here. Oh, they're, they're Send moving them to in. Fight. Interesting. Disheart in the enemy. Ah, oh, it's this banger again. do have a lot of people. That's a that's a point they only seem to have taken into consideration for the uh for the calculations now. Uh, you're, just, you're just gonna sit there now? Okay. You you moved up a little bit? over with the main unit. Uh, George, that's what happened. I'm fairly certain George is messing with the stream 
and making my screen just go nuts. So, any interruptions, my apologies. If it goes off completely, I'm sure I'll get a million messages again. <laughs> As opposed to now where I'm just getting a million messages in general. Which is, you know, humble brag. I'm just so popular. in we should we can outrange them easy I mean we'll be able to outrange them because we have the, the high ground but it's a question of how much damage we can actually do and what will hurt the most well ideally we'd take out the general but the, the, with archers that's very unlikely to happen Spread some disarray with some fire arrows. Might be an idea to take out their Velites. Probably do a lot of damage to them in the all. I've been said the, the Hastati is disorganized at the minute, so. Solves that question. Keep on moving out of position. Just curious. Yeah, I think they're getting back into the thing now. Wait for the Velites. Probably be able to take out more of them. And that'll, uh... Some bit of damage against the Velators here. And they can't shoot back because A, they're too low, and B, they don't have long range missiles like the Cretans do. The Cretans are like the only early game unit that get that. It's so powerful. You get like one and a half times the range of any other unit. It's ridiculous. Let's let the skirmishing go on a little bit. Oh god, I've just realised I've got two units of relatives. Well, I'm not taking all these out there, are we? There we go. Thank you. 
They're just they're, they're very calm for people who who are very much about to be on fire and kind of are already. Again, Romans, they have so much morale. Well, that's enough of the Cretans. They're, they're kind of done. Pop them up here. Right, well. Mercenary purpose. Only thing we can do now. Move up the front lines and try and uh, try and take them on head to head. This direction. Units. Oh, someone's moving up. Elites. Interesting. Units, double dive. Pop light. Downhill charge from uh, heavy cavalry against light cavalry. These guys do not really stand a fair chance here. Don't chase. Shooting at their own people. What's going on there? Yeah. Well, the equitors are coming back. They are slowly whittling them down. The thing being, they really don't have to kill as many of me as I do of them in order for this to be kind of a devastating loss. Because essentially this is like half of my entire armed forces. <laughs> uh, if, uh... Units! Units, run! There we go. Now what you're talking about, I didn't have any problem at all with uh, selecting the units. There we go. That should take care of them. Oh no, the Equites are going to try and charge heavy cavalry uphill. That is not going to work out the way they want it to.
Yeah, I'm just getting destroyed by endless bell tasks right now. They got, they've just got the heavy cavalry left, really. Go, go, go. I do not want to have to face that and head on right now. Get rid of everything else first. Oh, I started just falling apart. I'm so hot in here right now. My hair is actually sticking to my skin. Like, it's really it is not not a pleasant environment right now. So we are three hours away from the end. Three hours. So. If, you, uh, if you haven't donated yet, you've, you've still got a chance. I mean, the... the Oh, where am I? Oh, am I there? That's annoying. Uh, I mean, you, you've got like until I believe the end of tomorrow or Friday to uh, to do it. So it's not a it's not an urgent thing. But you know you'll forget if you're anything like me. You know you'll forget. That being said, if you're anything like me, you've got significant brain damage. So you know. Me, me. Maybe it's, it's a good idea to, to, to support the Stroke Association. It might be, might be in your best interest. Some might say. Oh, we're back on Oasis again. of ammunition. We are going to have to move up if we want to uh, if we want to take these people. Units. Right. Units. Ready. Aim. I'll tell you what, let's General. get the cavalry into the Velotes. Because if they want to fight back they're going to have to send their own cavalry in. At which point I've got them pinned down and I can move in my uh, my phalanxes. Thank the starter. There you go, that'll do. Pretty much there are only frontline infantry left. Do not chase <laughs> straight into the uh the Roman general. Is not what I need. Cheers, Ernest. Have a good one, buddy. Thanks for thanks for popping by. Appreciate all your support and the uh, and your donation. It's been, honestly, everyone everyone's support's been kind of kind of insane. Uh, especially for what I thought was just going to be a small little fun thing to do, and we've ended up raising like triple the original amount. So, like, thank you for for coming in. Now gotta move the uh phalanxes up.
Men of Sparta! Kill them! Oh, destroy them! The gods be praised! The enemy general is dead! His men know their doom approaches! The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are full of fear, and now they free! See if we can catch any of them. Doesn't seem likely because it's heavy cavalry chasing heavy cavalry, but nah, they're already out. Oh, this well. is a heroic victory, worthy of Greek soldiers. We lost twelve soldiers in that. Twelve. How did did we get any back? And we got three of those back. Twelve soldiers, three of them. So we lost nine people. And the uh, Cretan archers gained some experience. Isn't that handy? Kind of want them to have as much experience as we can. Do we take this momentum and try and take Larissa now? It's pushing it, isn't it? I'm going to head back because I'm worried about this army in Athens. Yeah, I think the uh, the heat is getting to me. I'm, uh, I'm second guess. Wait, like, did I do everything? Probably did not. Carthage got Carthage apparently owned Cordoba, or Cordoba as it's referred to at the sage. Is that army st Oh no, they just dropped off what another is? one. Calcius Brutus. Oh yes, God. Prepare for battle. Glorious victory! Attack! This army will fight to the end. They've got Pelotes, Hastati, Hastati. We might, yeah, we should be able to take this all right. Let's fight a night battle. That'll give us a bit more of an advantage. Watching from Olympus, make sure they are not 
not the same. the best advantage here. Units! Oh, just realized they've they're up there. Interesting. Units, run! We need to sort of maneuver them off the high ground if we can. Defaults. Units, make haste. Units, units, make haste. Units, units. Skirmishers. General in there to support. Oh, they're sending in war dogs as well. Yeah, that could break our flank. We really the do not want that. Is, running away. This is, no is way that for Alice? To behave, Did... but in battle, it is no, that belief. was theirs. Cool. The enemy general is slain, and now his men fear us. It is time to press the attack. General. Attack! Get him in the back. Yes. Right, General, please come back. I kind of, kind of need you over in this. Uh... In their javelins. Start to get armor piercing javelins. So, uh, a little bit threatening. A little bit threatening. <laughs> 
What we've got left is bellators and war dogs who don't have any dogs left. <laughs> I really thought this one through, haven't they? They're just charging me with heavy cavalry. This is over there. The enemy show their true virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running from our men. There we go. This is a victory fit for the gods. A day of triumph to mark with a song or two. I lost about 40 people. That's not bad. Pretty good fight. Yeah, got seven back. It's always nice. Meanwhile, they lost basically everyone and their general. We're really getting lucky with this Brutii attack, because if they had sent both of those armies at the same time, we would be done. Like, finito, over, finished. We'd, we'd look like that guy. Victory and honor! My lord! Ready! Attack! We are victorious! Prepare to engage! Oh no, we lost. Withdraw! Withdraw! <laughs> That's pretty bad. Ooh. That's even worse. They've got more armies coming. Oh, and Athens is only getting more and more defended. Cleomenes of Sparta, yeah. Oh, Hemnon of Sparta has gotten married. That's useful. Uh, superior commander, always good to have. Spain and Carthage are at war, okay. I mean, yeah, it's not unusual, but like, yeah, early. Usually, give it a couple of turns. I suppose we are on what turn ten. That's what I was looking at. Sermon. We still need people. Oh, we need to retrain all of these. Uh, just need construction. Keep the militia barracks going. Syracuse. Uh, I think city barracks. Armour top lights are very useful to get hold of, so if I can get them as early as possible, that's what, you want, that's what I want to aim for, really. Turn report. I'm keeping it going up. Uh, I want to ask the temple of Nike. Yeah, moving on to that now. Syracuse. That's sea barracks. So that's fine. We have we have stuff happening. now is that we've been so sort of fixated on the Brutii that the uh, Macedonians have grown out of control. We really need more, uh, more hot points. Melting it, <laughs> mate. I've been melting for hours. <laughs> the thing being, <laughs> like, I was playing Metal Gear is all right because it's not too demanding. But now my uh, my PC is really having to work for it. So it, uh, oh, is it kicking out some heat? Oh, could, uh, could 
do with a nice refreshing drink after all this. I mean, I'm, I'm drinking constantly, but I mean, like, of the alcoholic variety. Let us end the bloodshed. Ooh. They want a ceasefire. Do I take it? I do have a lot of enemies at the minute. I really don't need Macedon at the same time. But then if I don't fight Macedon, where am I expanding? Because I'm not expanding into Italy. <laughs> like, that's not happening. I'd have to move more into the ocean maybe take uh, Halicarnassus and uh, oh they've forgotten the name of the island but the, other than that we'd have to start expanding eastward into Pontus oh it's how's our power compared to theirs strength comparison we're, we're, we're about even Uh, what if we demanded they give us Athens? Regretfully, we must decline. Well, that solves our issue, doesn't it? Our ships are under attack! Oh no. Well, bye ships. Oh, that's bad. We need to, uh building a new navy because we really cannot be without one. Most advantage to faction is Egypt, interestingly. Uh, Armenia and the Seleucids are friends. Good job. Doros of Sparta, where are you? You're in Sparta. Who'd have thought? My Lord. Go over to Corinth. We need someone there just in case. I do not try. Where's my spy? I'm sure I have a spy around here. Yes, master. Check Athens. What have they got there? Oh, that is a lot of hoplites. And peltas and some straight up archers. General's kind of useless though, so I suppose that's something. Tell me more. Uh, oh, he does have some good traits and followers, though. I think I need to be War dead. War dead. reinforcing Corinth and looking to. My lord. Move in that direction towards Athens. But first, I I, I have to take Larissa. I just I just, I just do. Mercenary peltasts. That's not worth it. Not for the uh, the whole place. Train increase. He's a good spy. Nailed it. Now he's less likely to fail. I mean, he never failed, uh, fail? failed before anyway. But, uh, hey, now he's even less likely. My lord! Ranged units of any kind, especially archers, but just in general. Uh, 
step outside. See if you've got any creating mercen creating archers. That's perfect. Take them. Head back inside. Gonna want them. Those are good. Great new experiment. Oh, he's got mercenary captain, that's handy. Uh, construction report, roads and sparta. Oh, I need... Sparta for a minute. Oh, they're even reinforcing Athens even more. This is not a good sign for us. That is that is a heavy guard right there. More arches. Oh, it's not what you want. It is not what you want. Cleon of Sparta got married. Maybe Noel Gallagher. My Lord. At age 19. Days all sorts, I suppose. Go nuts. Right, uh. War dead. Gonna leave the archers here. But we're gonna do, we're gonna redo our failed attack on Masana. Besieging settlements, sir. He's older and wiser, and uh Maybe this time won't just be sent home in disgrace. Alliance between the House of Scipii and Macedon. Of course. All my, all my enemies are just best friends. Syracuse, calm down. Pergamon needs some building. Go with Hermes, I think. And Sparta still needs something. Uh, we'll get walls going. Canassas take that if we can. Preferably, preferably we do. But it's kind of a oh, we get some more peltasts. We really need those. Pretty much any range we'll take for this army at the minute because it's basically just purely hoplite. not because you can't even reach them. Good job. <laughs> Congratulations to Noel. We're all very happy for him. I mean someone should be. His brother's not gonna be, is he? My lord! Sir Onward. I sent reinforcements for the uh Sir for the faction leader. Because I do not trust that army. I think it's going to sneak up and attack me from, uh, from behind. Okay. But, uh, that was a bad decision. I have more men on the ships than you. Oh, no, that's bad. Well, bye. See you later. Good. 
Can't believe that my lord. Pontus had a spy in my territory. Back. Now just let me walk this army through Slaysids. <laughs> for that army than I am uh... and without building things which is probably not a good sign Pergamon need something building ooh get more trade going oh god we've used up all of our money finances are not in a good place He has 43 soldiers, he has 23. I think I can be forgiven for auto-resolving this one. Yeah, and uh, I lost 14 men. Just having to pay for for all these the upkeep of all of these soldiers. Um, most of which, mind you, are uh, I just sat around not doing anything. So I'm thinking we should probably get them to do something. Uh, Like, I don't know, attack Athens. Hey, they open the gates. Uh, seeing as I can't be bothered, I'm going to auto resolve that. Victory and honor! Settlement captured! <laughs> there we go. I just wanted to make sure that I've got that sorted now. So I've got. I've got Greece. I have Greece. All of Greece I have. It's the it's the northern areas that I do not have, which is the issue. What is Ships ready to Hermes going. God, we have just no money. It just vanishes every time. Rhodes and Pergamum are both growing, but we can't expand them. The needs of Sparta has got a uh, slave trader. Uh, just don't question it. All the Bruti are back. Oh. We yeah. have surrounded! I can't believe that they betrayed me in that alliance that didn't exist. Yeah, we lost. Please stop killing my ships while I'm trying to build them. I can't believe Carthage attacked me. How dare they? Oh, with the most advanced faction. Again, this isn't really where they were just going to auto resolve. Glorious victory! Settlement captured! Or is. Yes, Stratigos! Destroy them! Right, so. Oh god, you have elephants. Yeah, probably best that I fight you. That 
see how the uh, the fundraiser's doing. So it's three ten. But hey, I'm not going to come if, it, if that's uh, the final tally. I will take it. Before night comes, this battle will be done. Whether the day goes well or not is in our hands. Brave sons of Greece. Fight well and earn the favor of the gods. Some of us will soon lay dead. The rest of us will drink to their memory. But now, fight with honor. I'll spend money to make money. That's it, really, isn't it? Because the land I'm taking is pretty valuable. Especially in Greece, and uh, stuff in Sicily isn't bad. Like it's going to pay dividends in the uh, in the long game. Bear in mind, <laughs> we've got two and a half hours left of this, so uh, probably not going to see the long I'll game, but uh, I will. Uh, right. terrain we can really use. Not really. This, I guess, but it's more just in the way than anything. Units, uh... Units, make haste. Quickly. General, hurry. Gods be praised. The reinforcements are here. Send them to fight. Dishearten the enemy. Eric Slingers. Let's see about them. <laughs> that was a sudden musical change. Oh no, we've got the archers with just one. We've got a single archer just sat there. Offside. Yeah, they are on the wrong side, aren't they? What are you doing, guys? Get over here. You, you know, I think you can break phalanx for, for just walking over there. They move so slow in phalanx formations. Slingers and draw these guys out, but we don't want to get caught in an actual fight. Right? Hurry. Go, go, go. Run. Town militia. Oh, you should not be sending those after heavy cavalry. Or I'd be in infantry for that matter. 
Look at all this cavalry. Like the big worry is the elephants. Like, you, you ask Cersei, she'll tell you how much she needs the elephants. Come on, pull them back. to handle this. Could flank round the back, but I'll be honest, we'd just be flanking into cavalry and there's no point. Immediate mercenaries, they are a worry. Missile cavalry is notoriously difficult to fight. Attacking us. We're under uh, attack. I think the only thing we can do is go for a frontal assault. They are relying on their cavalry, so... stood around the simulator. That's essentially what happens. You stand around until you decide, yeah, this, this is the amount of people I'm okay with dying. <laughs> They're hiding, apparently. They are not try They are not in the mood for uh, for these guys. They're not having any of it. Ooh, maybe. If I can get the general around there. see it. There's the thing, if I can take out those Numidian mercenaries then everything gets a lot easier. Uh, I can effectively outskirmish them. Good. We've got them. We've got hold of them. That's good. Take out the Numidians. That's uh, that's a check in the wing column. Right. So. Oh god! Run! 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 Do not get into a fight with elephants. Elephants are bigger than you. Run, 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 run. General. Right, we need to hit them in the flank while they're chasing after the other cavalry. Like, the thing about elephants, their charge is deadly. That thing w Oh, no. Yep, that... Oh, oh react fast enough, but they are very easy to startle.
And if you can get them to, to run wild, essentially they're... Uh, your general has thrown away his God. life and now feeds the carrion birds. Who's dead? Men may oh, bird oh no. Too. Noel Fielding. Noel Fielding? <laughs> Noel Gallagher is dead. Noel Fielding maybe is way off. Oh, I don't know. oh, this is not a good sign. Yeah, burn. Get out of there. Oh no. This is bad. I don't think we've got this one. Oh, the elephants are moving into position. Ah, I got them. Oh, it was a hell of a sacrifice, but they are now running away. That's good. Uh, there's not much else they can fight us with. Anything else I'm pretty much ready to take out. <laughs> yeah, the problem is I'd just be flanking into cavalry. And they will be, at that point, I may as well go straight up because all I've got is phalanxes. <laughs> uh, and I, this general is recovered, but other than that... in and hope that the uh, the hoplites are enough to we just grind them down. But light cavalry are not going to react well to uh, Oh no, they got caught out of position. Not bad. Send in the uh Our ally has been slain! Now we will see if his men can hold in the face of this calamity. Your allies uh, do you mean my <laughs> you mean you mean my general? Because uh, spoiler alert, I'm the ally. Yeah, lost two generals, but I should hold the uh, the city, which I guess is something. It should cover my uh, array from being flanked. That way I can. <laughs> oh, I see what's happened. The general is chasing after this one archer that we <laughs> we just brought along because it was in the city. Run away, Archer. Run away. Oh, he's not having a good day. Oh no! Oh no, keep running! Run faster! Oh no! Oh, he's dead! Oh, the humanity! Oh no, there's another one! Oh no, they're not bothering. He's got, he's got away. It's fine. <laughs> right. 
yet, so it's really left to these slingers and the general. The real problem is the general, because <laughs> he can outmaneuver us. <laughs> Got so so much going on. I swear, I, it was that it was that one phalanx that was just slightly out of position. I didn't cover it, and uh, they, just, they just all piled on that flank, which is a shame because this could have been much smoother, but it it just, it just wasn't. But in my defense, it is like 30 degrees in this room. <laughs> That's it. That's the only excuse I've got. It's really hot. They're apparently withdrawing. Uh, Attack! The enemy general is running away. Oh, we're not going to catch this the general, no so. God be praised! This victory is surely their work, not that of mortals like us. I mean, it looks it looked bad, but we only like technically lost like 200 men, which is not that bad. Like, don't get me wrong, it's not good, but it's survivable. Living the army, glorious victory! We do need to uh, get these troops trained back up. some armoured hoplites if we can. Man of the hour. Uh, Captain Epimenes. Wow! <laughs> Age 20 and he has level 6 command. That is a general and a half. Superior commander, command talent, understanding of strategy, drill master. What does drill master do? I've forgotten. I'll have to check in a minute, but yes, I will adopt it. The the man that should have been adopted has died and gone to Hades instead. The game is just mocking me. Cleon of Sparta has uh, become a confident commander as he died. about to chase that guy down, but uh, not a good idea. This is the thing. Ideally, we'd be able to just like counter-attack and take Lily by him, and then we have Sicily as a stronghold, essentially, but we just don't have the troops over there. Uh, so we're going to focus on Halicarnassus up here. And, uh... Mm. Mm. It's not... It's not looking good. Oh, I need a drink. Hold on a sec. To be fair, this is... This is a pretty standard early Greek game. You just sort of have to weather the storm of everyone trying to attack you and then as you get more and more powerful, you really can't be stopped. Similar to the uh, the Slayer Sits, actually. If you <laughs> Slayer Sits are unreasonably hard to to play as, 
but like if you can if you can survive and uh, keep your empire intact then you get so many good units and like so many uh, so many buffs it's they're, they're almost broken but their early game is so difficult that it's kind of balanced out that way If he attacks them, and I would send soldiers to back him up. But other than that, I really can't see us doing much over there. Ready to sail. Ready to sail. Yes, Captain. Ready. Only has one command. Good job, Admiral. Ready. That name. Kedonia, that was the name of the island. I I'll figure it out eventually after I looked it up. Sparta really needs something. Uh, get a stone wall. Let's get that Temple of Hermes. We really need to keep this money coming in. Uh, Hermes again, I think. Like, really, our powerhouse for, like, building units is going to be these here, these guys here. Uh, and maybe some stuff in Syracuse, but other than that, we're really going to be focusing on getting money because, oh god, are we, we're not in a good way. Uh, Brodian Slingers. Not bad. Not bad. Mastery Pelicans are fine. Uh, it just doesn't, doesn't fit at the minute, so... Trader. I don't want to invest too much in case we do end up losing Syracuse, in which case uh, all that money is gone for a while at least. Get the trader going again. I don't want to invest too heavily. Oh, well, and that's our money, so. Huh. Brutus doesn't seem to be attacking us, which is curious. But the rebels are ready. Ramming speed. Uh. Yeah, why not? Let's go. Oh, we did it. We are victorious. Yes, Hooray. Captain. Please retrain these boats and give me another one. Sir. Right, let's try Alicarnassus. Uh, what do we got? There's no general because it's a, uh, a rebel base. Oh, they do have Cretans. And decent hoplites. And Peltasts. And Slingers. Oh, good. I was just thinking, damn, this would be. Almost too easy. You know me, I love to just throw all my men's lives away. Vegeta? Let him who desires peace prepare for war, as said by Prince Vegeta. I mean, I can't prove that that's, that's who they're talking about, but it could be. Inevitable, but victory hangs in the balance. 
act like sons of Achilles and victory will be within your grasp. We go now to our bloody business. Hell of a speech. Just incredible speeches. On my order. You know, only, only the Romans really get the, the great speeches. Uh, otherwise, you just kind of have to make do. We don't want the Cretan archers on the rams. That is literally the last people we want on the rams. Militia hoplites. Move, move! Got information. Use the ram. And you. Up like militia. Got information. Phalanx, pick up that ram. Cool. Right. Arches of Crete. Ram. Ram. Quickly. Ram. Who is shooting? Oh, the creep. No. Why are they shooting? For? Oh, these guys. You can exchange uh, missile fire at long range, but uh, I have two lots of Cretan archers there and they only have one. Our soldiers are so. at the walls. Now they must battle their way through. Our soldiers are at the gates. Now they must battle their way through. They must battle their way through. <laughs> Why are they South African? That's a good question. <laughs> I think they're abandoning the walls. Uh, I'd say I blame them. But, like, you'd think they put up some kind of fight. Has done its work. Orders completed, Commander. Ready. Up like militia. The gods have smiled on us today. The walls are broken. Our troops should be ordered forward. Oh, how clever. He shot fire arrows over the buildings. Doesn't matter though, because I've already broken down the gate and one of the walls. So. Well, this day, the walls are taken. Will you, will you please return fire on the Cretan archers? It'll be very handy. All right, set some fire. Could do with uh, weakening their morale. Destroy them! 
Did they just send the Cretan archers into an actual fight? Like a, a melee fight? Because that is... Why? back but I, I guess to try and just defend the square but like spoiler alert, I have a lot of arrows left and uh, you are you are you really don't have a defense for it so Try to charge the phalanx. Uh, it's not what I'd call a good decision. Great God be praised! The enemy general is killed! Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts! Look at how high those arrows go. And then they just rain down on the enemy, setting them on fire. Is they can't really route if they're on the uh, if they're on the square. They'll just instantly like go back to wavering. Exactly much of a threat at the minute. Hoplites! 
way they're charging the phalanx again. Nailed it, guys. You really, uh, really know how to handle this. They actually managed to. Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Uh, dog fans. Go up there. Stop it. Go, go, go! Just a few remnants of uh, units here, to be honest. There's not much to really keep us from taking the place. And the only real phalanx is over there. <laughs> There's a whole three troops here. I'm fairly certain. Should be able to handle them. Orders completed, Commander! Kill them! Or you would think, anyway. There's one guy left, guys. Really, though, there's one guy. Militia hoplites, kill them! Dead bodies everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, a lot of them mine, which uh, is not ideal. Go, just, just stab him. Jesus. There we go. Please get out of the way of the phalanx. No, don't run into the phalanx. What are you doing, you morons? I'm not sure how much more clear I could have been there. 
get out of the way of the phalanx. Like, was... Right, I'm not sure how much more clear I can be now. Fire. Fire into the back of the phalanx, where its weak spot Hot is. So they do have more than us, and they're better hoplites. So really this is an exercise in holding them here. Oh no, they took they took the thing. Oh well. It's the enemy army is in right, fight. it's done. Them. Drive them from the they're not real people, they're rebels. Yeah, they don't count. Right. God be praised. We only this lost 200 men, which is not, not bad. That of mortals like us. Considering we killed like 470. Uh. Plus, we now get the uh, Mausoleum of Halicarnassus, which not the most powerful, but it's pretty handy if you're uh, if you're building something big. Victory! Uh, getting so many Steam achievements. An agent in Pontus, they've been there a while. Oh, I've become the largest faction. I, I mean, I, I guess. I mean, at some point, I will take uh, take Sardis, but it, you know, I don't want to start with the Slayersids right now. Especially considering I'm not convinced that Brutus isn't about to attack us. I have a diplomat anywhere around here. I don't think I do. Oh, that wall. What's that building? Can't need things. So you build anything? Yeah, we'll get. We'll give you something else as well, because uh, kind of kind of needs stuff to do. There you go. I should keep it busy. What? What did I? Oh, I just <laughs> clicked onto Athens. Okay. Well, when you're done, build some mines. Let's uh, get these repaired. Trader going. Don't know. Right. Uh, I can't ask this. What did I want to feed you? Repair the wall for a start. Try to Hermes. Come on now, can it? doing anything? Roads, oh no. Oh, that was scary for a second. I thought it had crashed. Uh, I can only afford sewers, so I guess you're getting sewers. Uh, a turn. Carthage is attacking us again. Carthage, what did I do to you? I, how did I upset you?
Okay. Uh, wait. Oh no, I've just. Yeah, they can just walk straight in. Because it's. Oh, that's not good. They can just walk straight in because they've got uh, they've got elephants. How much caffeine have you consumed? Not enough, and yet far too much. It's basically the only thing keeping me upright. But also the thing that means I really have to go to the bathroom. But, uh, I'm not going to bother fighting this. I still apparently have two thirds of my soldiers, so that's nice. But I've lost Masana. Early. Yeah, if you, early game AI for the Romans is very specific. Like, if you're playing as, say, like, Brutii, eye, you can just screw over both of the other factions. If you take Masa, uh, not Masa, Syracuse, and I can't remember one of the the territories up here, the AI doesn't know what to do because th those are necessary for its expansion plans. I think Apollonia as well. It, so they they will just get stuck. They will just stay there. So now <laughs> Carthage is going to probably grow out of control because the Skiffy I have no idea where to expand to. But you can see they've got... Uh, they've got Cordova. They've, uh, it's Cordova? Words escape me, honestly. The heat has taken over. And they're, they're kind of just going to go unchecked in the south for a while. Um, and more than that, the Brutii uh, seem to have like lost interest in fighting me. So, Rome in general, the only thing we'd have to worry about is the Julii fighting the Gauls up north. And as, as we all know, I hate Gauls, but it it's not exactly a threat to us at this stage. <laughs> yeah, the settlement's been occupied. Uh, I'm not sure I can do about that now. Oh god. Scythia has become allies with uh, Macedon and Dacia. That's that's bad, because the more allies that Macedon has, the fewer people they're fighting. And I kind of want them to be fighting people that aren't me, so I don't have to do all of the fighting. It's a, it's a complicated concept, I'm sure. Ships ready! Uh, Basileos. Isn't that the name of the... of the Seleucid leader? The Basileus? Fairly certain. Oh, there's so many. Ready to sail. So my plan at the minute for Sicily is to just hole up in Syracuse, just build up as much as I can, and just slowly work my way back to Masana. I don't know how how's Lily by I'm doing. Do I have a yeah? I have yes, a, uh, my lord. Thing yes, over here, so I can go and check. Oh, that's interesting. I can't see Lily by him, but that's a Julii ship, and it does have troops on it. They are expanding out here. That's curious. Right, Pergamum. You, you, need, you need buildings. Uh, we have some mines. Right. Them on. Uh, get some sewers. They're cheap and uh, they raise happiness. Which we could do with making sure because right now, the last thing we need is for the people to start rioting or something. Uh, Alcarnassus. Uh, <laughs> don't need to worry about Masana. You know what, I can uh, train or build a military barracks now. Because 
There's no point in trading prisons. There's the time. I, uh... I am going to take a couple of minutes break. Just because I need the bathroom really badly. So, we'll be back in a couple of minutes. Won't be long. I'm back. I said it would only be a couple of minutes. I think we're up to 12. I'll uh, add on at the end now. Just double check that I'm coming through. Yep, that's fine. Ready to sail! Don't you boo me, Bernard. should be a really good investment. We should have a lot of income pretty soon. I go to return report. <laughs> Are we upkeep? It's nearly nine grand. Construction seven. Jesus. We do get nine grand on its own from taxes and seven for farming. So I suppose it works out. Trade is the thing we really need to start getting up. I don't know we get so much benefit from it. Go to a governor's palace. Thank you. Oh, there's so many places that need expanding, but we're, ju we're just having to pick and choose because of money. Oh, now they're attacking it. Okay. We are surrounded! Let us now talk reasonably. Ceasefire, they will give us money. You know what? I think we've expanded enough into uh, Macedon. We've got Greece, oh, we're going to start looking eastward. So. Well, we've got no benefit of wiping out the... Uh, 
the Macedonians just yet. What's the game where you raise the rice tax all the time? Uh, look, a good question. I, I'm, I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't doesn't make a bell. Rice tax. Do I go for Byzantium? That's a thought. A fleet Ready to to reasonably carry some troops. Sword of the Samurai. Not familiar. A candidate for adoption. Eh, it's not bad. It's not bad. Could do with more commanders. So. A new son adopted. The aggressive Gomfi. Yeah. My lord! My lord! I'm lucky because we really. This guy's more of a governor. Uh, him in Athens might not be a bad idea. They're pretty much going to be my backbone. Where are you going, Secundus? To uh, you at war with Carthage? Yeah, you are. So you might be heading round to uh, to blockade them, which would be. <laughs> We're we're far we're, we're way stronger than the Julii at the minute. Be nice. We're also stronger than Carthage. We're just not stronger than Carthage on Sicily at the minute. Yeah. Not the Brucii. Oh no! Oh, the Scipii are just done, aren't they? Look, that's it. That is all of the Scipii, right there. That's all they've got. I suppose Rome only has that, but it's, Rome's still pretty strong. That Macedon. There's really not much left to them, is there? Apollonia. Mm, if they fall that, there's... Uh, if that falls, there's Thessalonica. Other than that, they've really got nothing. Maybe I shouldn't have signed that ceasefire. I suppose I can, uh, I can just come back and take them out later. Check the family tree. Uh, oh wow, George of Sparta. Uh, Doros is actually his son. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Doros's son is older than he is. He's 19 and he adopted a 26 year old. What? I mean. I to each their own, but there's a limit here. Come on now. We do have, I suppose, some is going to turn 16. I think 16 is the uh, age of adulthood in this game. I think in a few years, uh, Nicanor. Uh, oh, there's a lot going on. Oh, the fact that he adopted someone nearly a decade older than him. Did he adopt him as like a granddad? Ready. 
Yes, Stratigos. Ships ready. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hold off on. I'm gonna hold off on taking Byzantium right now. Because if I wait and then this guy's son comes of age, he'll come of age in Halicarnassus. Which means we can leave him here as a governor. And uh look for Byzantium without which would be quite handy. Because Byzantium, pretty big city. Assuming that like the Dacians or anything can Raise the rice tax. I don't have any rice. I want to raise the rice tax. I need to, like, discover rice. I'm pretty sure that doesn't happen for a while. Send in these guys as reinforcements. So he's only command level four. I don't know his traits though. He shouldn't be able to use night fighter, so any attack on Thurman will bring in these guys as reinforcements. <laughs> Doris of Sparta has, uh, has become a philosopher, and his philosophy is I'm going to adopt someone way older than me. Uh, into a region, which is actually pretty handy. Thrace and Dace of uh, Side of War. Scythia and Dacia are at war. All broken the reliance at least. Thrace and Germania. And we're in a ceasefire now, isn't that wonderful? I suppose it gives us a chance to see off Brutus. What are the peasants going to do? The peasants. Yeah, raise the rice tax. What are they going to do? Not eat. Let's get a blacksmith in Sparta. Do a team. Point. Yes, you, uh, Cretan archers. That's what we like. We like Cretan archers in this house. Uh, I would love to have a governor over there, but sadly not. They're so far away, it's hard to send a ship over. I have played Crusader Kings 2. It's, I've played a lot of Crusader Kings 2. I've, I've, I've played a lot of Crusader Kings 3, but probably not as much, but then again, it's not been out as long. Um, I haven't actually played the, uh, the DLC for it yet. I'll have to get around to that. Gaul and Britannia, Syria and Germania. Raise. The, is it taxes? Yeah. That was 
the bridge here, I have stopped. Not, not convenient. Yeah, I, I, I get that with Paradox. They, they tend to like release so much DLC that it's a completely different game by the time it's uh, a couple of years in. I've a, I, play, I play a few Paradox games. I've been playing a lot of uh, Hearts of Iron over the last couple of years, which which is a really weird statement when I think about it. Oh yeah, over the last couple of years I've got into Hearts of Iron, but I feel like you need that. For them, and he's got salty as they got a PS5 or so. I, th I know one of Ben's mates did My work Lord. at Paradox. Um, I don't know they got salty about a PS5. I feel like everyone's salty about the PS5. Wow, there's re you, they don't have any spearmen. What's stopping me just sending my... Alright. I'm gonna send my cavalry in. Alright, I guess, just sit there. This army balance is not, uh, not what you'd hope for. spear and shield put on your helmet put aside the fear in your hearts and remember that you are the sons of great soldiers like you aren't great soldiers but your parents were now then look to your front mark your target and let them worry don't about you, you talk to me about the winter stars I, at certain points, I've had to turn off the uh, like the music packs because they play so often, like, and it's always like the same couple of songs. There's really not enough variety for like songs with words, so it just gets stuck in your head. Why is he Scottish? Why aren't you? Mercenary Beltists. God be praised! The reinforcements are here! Send them to fight! Dishearten the enemy! deserved it. Why weren't you Scottish? All Greeks are actually Scottish. Yeah. Do you not know? God, but I can't believe you haven't kept up with your your history. Which uh, you 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 did at uni. Like you don't think you did. You think you did your uh, environmental studies, but you actually you actually did history.
again. I think you can I think you can break phalanx for walking over there. Right guys, so you should probably be back in a balance now. So. That's, that's on me. I forgot to tell you. Try to pass along that news. These guys are going nuts. They're going straight here. Oh no, they're running away. Bye guys, I guess. holding all right. We are pushing them back. I kind of don't want them to, to hunt it. <laughs> what are you doing, guys? Guys, no. Okay. <laughs> guys. <laughs> guys, this is a bad idea. Don't, don't, talk, to, don't talk to me about the dogs, okay? It's their fault. There are no bad dogs, only bad owners. They're all good dogs. Missiles in the air. Guys, again, this is not a good. <laughs> oh no! Who could have seen this coming? I don't think that's his name.
a lot of skirmishing going on. Right. I'd say it's time that we roll the, uh, the skirmishes up. Now they're taking out the Hastati, I believe there are only two of them. So anything at this point is, uh, is going to be... Yeah, there's the Valentez charging. Yeah, anything at this point is going to be ranged. Are they withdrawing? No. Is the more the more we route, the more that will be routed. But that, yeah, yeah, no dirt, Aaron. But like, I mean, the more we route, the more that we'll just start giving up on the own. I actually, don't want to stand and fight with these guys. I just want to draw them in. Them into the front lines. General is running away. This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it is beyond belief. Alright. So, <laughs> guys, stop, stop chasing the general. He's done. He's leaving. It's over. Oh, yeah, there's, there's nothing they can do at this step. Oh no, the general is staying. Okay. The gods have filled now the enemy general again. with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. But the gentleman's bodyguard, even with all of these Valentines, they are not frontline fighters. The enemy this army is not going to end well for them. Pursue them. Drive them from the battlefield. Guys, down to just get all that lovely experience. Oh no! Oh no! You're running the wrong direction. God be praised! This victory surely they work. Wow! Like us. <laughs> we uh, we won that one pretty uh, pretty definitively. They have a hundred soldiers left. What are we doing? Uh, look, a few healed. Uh, other than that, we really, we really didn't lose many people. Most of them were those uh, that one lot of hoplites that I forgot to put back in phalanx. Whoops. Genuinely, no clue. Not sure where uh, the general went to. Maybe he just died. Shield bear. Alright, that's what we're doing alright here. Fifth 
if this guy wanted to, oh, I don't know, throw himself at Masano, I would not be against him. Wow, there's really not I much in the way. Our patience is limited. You insult us! Well, <laughs> can't buy him. I should speak Maybe I can buy one. Masano back. Wouldn't that be fun? They d they spent all that effort to, to take Masana and I just buy it back. Uh, I don't really think I need to spend much more this turn. No firing, why not? Retrain. Get some roads going. The Seleucids want an alliance. See, <laughs> that's... B <laughs> the problem with that is that their enemies with Egypt, Parthia, Pontus, Armenia, and, well, everyone's at war with the rebels, but you get my point. And they have no other allies. I, it, so instead of doing that, I'm not going Until to. Until next time. And um, we'll catch you on the flip side. By flip side, I mean when all of your colonies are flipped to a different colour. Colonies, cities, either one. Flash flood in. No. Yeah, I only want that. Yeah, this is this is accurate. Ionia. I don't recognize that. Interesting. Coming of age, there he is, Eugenius of Sparta. How are you, Eugenius? You are not a bad governor. In that case, you're going to stay here. Ships ready! And, uh. Yes, sir! Yes, Stratagos! Someone else is going to come. Sir! Set sail! On this boat and go and take. Uh... Yes, sir! God, wouldn't it suck if this sank now? Go and attack uh, Byzantium. Diplomatic information. Nothing really new. The the, the twenty six year old that was adopted by uh, by the nineteen year old is still going strong. I said he's, uh, he's got he's, he's he's got a doctor. Uh, he's got a, a priest. Egypt is the most advanced faction, I guess. Your hot lines. Oh, really? Nice. Uh, need to keep building. Pretty much the only way we're going to get the, uh, the economy. We need to keep these troops up. Um, uh, the oh, we're running out of things to build in other houses. I really need uh, what is going on there. This one is. Oh, uh, I looked at it, and na now it's happy. What? <laughs> Did I click something I didn't realise? Is this now the capital? Did I do that? Don't know. I think it is. No. 
weird. Squalor, that's the big thing at the minute. We'll be able to fix that once it gets to the governor's palace. About to erupt. Yes, my lord. I shall speak with them at once. I shall speak. Be quick. Our patience is limited. If we may have a private word, well, uh, when you're just going to bribe like these guys. I I should speak quick. Our patience is limited. If we may have a private word. Yeah, you know what? Eleven grand for uh, for a city and a general. I will take well, that. Uh, when that you is put not it a bad like that. deal. Oh, there's Croton. Uh -huh. Doing brilliantly over there, aren't they? Sir, yes, send some off. armored hot plates over here, so it's. Oh, I didn't get general. Interesting. Oh, that's why, because the agent was the spy. Fair enough. I thought, I thought it said general. I can't raise the rice tax. We own no rice. Would I, I could, you know what? I'm, I suppose I could raise the rice tax. I could raise it to whatever I want, but no one, it wouldn't mean anything because no rice. My lord, where would I even get the rice? Right, usually, East Asia, where you'd find rich I'd rice, but Ready. we have no such rice. The word rice has lost all meaning. Uh, now this goes. Right, Pontus, will you stop sending spies into Pergamum? <laughs> Please. A suitable husband. Yeah, yeah. Terminus of Alpidos. Why not? Uh, more generals, or Sandy. Where is this guy? Oh, well, we've got a, a governor for Sparta now, I suppose. Ready to sail! Set sail! Oh, Thrace is taken by Byzantium. When do they do that? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, yes, Captain! Oh, well, I'll get, we'll, we'll, we'll head back down here and take Cadonia. Yes, Captain. I'm I'm not familiar with African rice. Does it does it grow in North Africa? Because that's all we've got. Uh, anything south of Egypt, it's unlikely. Oh, we're. Uh, we're at the most advanced faction again. This this guy, what? Uh, he's he's getting so much stuff. God, librarian, why are you not better? <laughs> Wait, only two one two. Syracuse needs more stuff. We will never have enough defense. Yeah, yeah, we're not getting anything from West Africa. The most we've got is, I think there's like a city around here, maybe, but like, we're not getting to like Mali or anything. Raise the grain tax then. Um, no. There you go. 
Retrain. I can retrain the general, as you do. Uh, let's, let's get another port. We need more. Let's go with the Agora. Corinth needs something new building. Uh, I'm making a hard push for port. Uh, You know, you know why I'm not going to raise the grain tax? Because you didn't say that it wasn't financial advice. Yes, that's, sir. Uh, that's your problem. If you, if you said it wasn't financial advice, I'd have done it. Do it now, Roy. Move out. Oh, the Bruti are you back? Twinfa. Twinfa. That was financial advice, I'm guessing. Even. Uh, I think we've got something building everywhere. Yeah. Out on a turn of building. <laughs> Retraining the peasants, I should realise. Oh well, we could use it. Buy Dogecoin. Also, look weirdly, no. Oh, I just realised we can build things in Masana. That wasn't financial. You've got to, you can't, you can't abbreviate within abbreviations. <laughs> That's not going to work. Ready to sail. Race the Dogecoin tax. <laughs> Don't you talk to me about the delicious jelly donuts. Oh, the Skippy Eye are back. Hello, Skippy Eye. This is actually just a little bit sad. It's like the rem... Like, he's, he's brought his friends as well. Like, it's just... It's like the leftovers. Of so, a, uh, I shall be quick. Can Our I patience you? is limited. If we may have a we can. word... Well, when you put it like that... General. We've got the generals. Orders, general, sir, imperator, general. Right, you're going to Syracuse. Sir. You, you're going to Masana. <laughs> I've just, I've, oh, that's just insult to injury, to the Scipio. Right. Got there. Uh, Round shield cavalry. And, oh wow, there's really not much there. Oh no, it's just Velitas. Oh, you guys are. Oh, Circus needs to expand. We do not have the money because I spent it all on recruiting the general. Um, we build in one turn. Last hour. We're in the last hour. Eh, we're technically we got a little bit before the last hour because I owe some time because of the uh, the breaks and the stream going down, etc. I think the exact time we finish now is uh, twelve minutes past eight. Yeah, is it last hour essentially? I'm gonna I'm gonna set an alarm.
it's going to go off at exactly uh, 12 minutes past 8. Right. There you go, it's an hour and nine minutes from now. And that starts going. We are we are done. That is the 12 hours. And oh boy, <laughs> am I feeling it. Oh, I'm 90% I'm sweat now. I mean, I was before, but like, it's outside of my body. What was I doing? Is there anything I can build in and turn? Uh, I was going to hold off and build something next time. Some roads going. I think Athens doesn't have roads. Get trader. Always good to have. Pergamon. Volcanassus doesn't have anything that it can build, so that's a good sign. Um, trader's building there. between Spain and the House of Julian. Uh, family tragedy. I don't know who that is. For me. Uh, is this? Who was Clamine? Uh, oh, really? Who? Oh, was the uh, the leader's wife? Oh no, died at the. Actually, to be fair, 63. Pretty pretty good for this era, isn't it? I'm actually a little bit worried about our faction leader. Because uh, he is most likely not long for this world. Who's our heir? Who, who is our heir? Is it? Oh, I think it's Memnon. Memnon who has no children. Memnon, get on it. I, I need to... Let's overrun... Uh, road, isn't he? What's wrong with you? Just, 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 just pop out some kids. Ready to sail! Yes, sir! Oh, that's the Brutii, I, I guess. Are they going round to attack Corinth? Hard to say. Ready to sail! Yeah. I'll tell you what we're alright for this turn. Alright, oh, eruption at Etna, forgot about that. My arm has been affected. And this guy is sneaky. We're the strongest faction now. Hooray. We've got children. Like this guy, he's become... He's becoming dangerous. He's way too... Like, he's 28. He's up to like level 4 in management, 2 in command and 1 in influence. Sparta. Yeah, I think we built some more because we could really do with it. Oh, before I forget anything, Syracuse needs its councillors' chambers. Uh, Pergamon needs something to build in. Get a wall going. German. Uh, land clearance. <laughs> it was a really basic thing you should probably have had a while ago. Oh no, Corinth. There's nothing that I can build because it's too expensive. Athens, I can build a port. Uh, Masana, 
called Trader. I think I'd rather get that into the port. And we're back out of money again. Oh well. Ready! Yes, sir! All ashore! Yes, Tradagon! Destroy them! Besieging settlements, sir! Does it have walls? <laughs> oh, I left Kidonia too. Long. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. Oh, well. it didn't look properly. Well, if, it, if Kidonia has walls, wow. You never build walls. Rebels barely ever build anything. I don't know if they can build anything. Let's fight a night battle. Why not? And pressure hot fights. Ooh. Cilician pirates. You don't see these very often. They're, uh... And they're not as dangerous as any of the other stuff, but like definitely interesting. Unique looking. I think they throw tridents and stuff. Basically Aquaman turned up. Tonight we will feast and drink. Tonight, we will tell each other tales of our bravery, but before that, we must beat our foes and show them why we are the heirs of Alexander and Achilles! Oh, the, the we go now to our bloody business! <laughs> All the, uh, the Greek speeches are just, wow, we used to be cool <laughs> back in the day, am I right? Great archers. Why are, why are all of the missile units in front? We absolutely do not want that. Uh, we're going to send some hot fights around here. Move, move. Militia hot lights. And some hot fights around here. We're going to pincer them. Run! Cretan archer. Uh, Cretan archer. We'll keep the. Uh, Keep the archers on this side. We will put a general on each flank. Wait. Did I send his son with him? I think I sent his son with him when I meant to leave him as a as a governor. Oops. Go, go, go. Oh. He's on each side. That way they can come in for a flanking maneuver. Oh, these are archers. I thought they were going to attack the... Uh... Oh wow, what a charge. Take out those freaking archers. I 
Finish your hoplites! Kill them! Kill it all! Take! Hoplites! Let's get you guys. Move on to the plaza. That should keep them. Oh, careful. These guys are taking some hits. Thing is, in a, in a hoplite versus hoplite battle, it's really just wait and see who runs out of troops first. And they'll both deplete at the same rate, so it's whoever has the most at the start. And they do not. Um, I mean, we'd have more if my Cretans wouldn't keep shooting my own men in the back. So that the spirit of his army is a broken tool. Up like militia. Run! Militia, up like attack! All right, just walk forwards now. And you just. Fire! Yeah, it, it, it's shooting. But I'm not personally, but. As a rule, Cretans are supposed to shoot over things. That's kind of what they do. Uh, occasionally they're just massively inaccurate and shoot your own troops. They still kill way more of the uh, the enemy, so it's not like it's a huge deal, but it is an annoyance. Just one Cretan just sat there. Oh dear, you seem to have just stood there while a phalanx walked up to you. Victory... Uh, victory seems certain according to them. The gods be praised! The enemy general is dead! His men know their doom approaches! This is incredible, like phalanx on phalanx on phalanx maneuvering here. Like we're just, they're going into the flank of my phalanx, so I'm going into the flank of their phalanx. While my other phalanx waits in reserve, so that I can flank with it. The thing about uh, starting to increase, you just get a lot of phalanxes. You want to kill that Cretan because he is just standing there. Like, 
please, Matt. Look, you're, you're facing the wrong way. Oh, he's gone. He's dead. That's fine. Right, now, now fight back against the... I can hear marching, but like, who's moving? No one's marching. Why is it still playing the marching sound? It's really messing with me. It's coming from these guys. Imagine just being like one of six guys left there, and you're like, "Yeah, we can win this." Literally, so many phalanxes on phalanxes on phalanxes. Have you not kept? I know, this right? This is a heroic victory, worthy of great soldiers. It's a heroic victory, though. What? Oh, there we go. I lost seventy odd men. That's fine. Oh, I've got 11, 12 back, so it's not, it's not that bad. And I killed 400, so... Yeah, it's, it's kind of the problem with, uh, phalanxes on phalanxes. There's, uh... You, you just, you just end up waiting for them to be ground down. It's, uh, it's not what you'd call engaging. Still, we've got Cadonia now, which is Settlement captured. nice, I guess. Really enjoying that we've now got basic, well, not all of Greece, but most of Greece. There's Thessalonica up here, and I think Apollonia counts, but like, otherwise, in, the, in this stream, we have managed to take Greece and most of Sicily. We can take Lilybium, and I'm considering this stream a success. My lord? Can we buy Lilybium? Be quick. Our patience is limited. I, <laughs> uh, no, no, looking at our financial overview. You insult us! We have, we have 177 denarii. Probably, probably, probably best not. Exotic slave. Don't you talk to me about the wing for summons. You imagine, right? He's playing this game, all of a sudden, like, just... Like, people started para-dropping in with, like, World War II machine guns, and they've just got lost on the way to the other game. Like, like how? How did you manage this? So right, good on you. Can we build... Oh, well, no, we can't build anything because we have no money. Oh well, I don't need much money now. Until the next turn. <laughs> the Skiffy hide doing the only thing I can and blockading my port. Uh, Polydeus of Sparta. Immersion broken. You say that, I say whole new level of immersion as they simulate time travel. Yeah, the eject in this is horribly wrong. It oh oh. <laughs> like Egypt in this era was actually kind of very Greek, but like no, in this they decide to go ancient Egypt, uh, despite the fact that being well out of date by about ten thousand years. Let's go with a trader. Uh, Larissa needs something building. Or, or do we want to mark it? Temple. Good idea. Let's get a wall for a start and then. 
fish right to Hermes. Uh. Uh, it's weird, isn't it? Because there's so many details in this game that are so... Like, no one would be able to notice it. That I... You... That they included it anyway. Your command. I shall be quick. Our patience is limited. You insult us. Nope. Uh, like they couldn't. They couldn't figure out that Egypt advanced a bit. I just just a tad. I'm gonna pull some pebble tasks. Blockading my port by accident. Because, uh. Hey, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna do this on the battle map. Just because you had the balls to blockade my port while you're running away. With. as one unit of Felites on an island where you have no support and don't have any territory. Kind of, just kind of want to teach them a lesson at this point. Who doesn't love a squash match? Try not to laugh at the enemy men. Those about to die. Oh yeah, this guy's Roman. By that. Yeah, he sounds like a Roman because he's Roman and we bought him. So now he works for Greece. <laughs> as as a result, he has nothing much to say. Units, await my orders. General. Uh, just just charge. I just want to see what happened. Like, how's this gonna go? I'll put it in slow motion when it gets close. Let's just. Oh no! Bye! Yeah, these guys are not going to last long. The enemy! Oh. Wow, I can't believe they managed to kill the captain of a group of villagers. Still. This is a victory fit for the gods, a day of triumph to mark with a song or two. <laughs> Can't believe we managed to lose four soldiers. So we got one back, so I suppose that's something. See then, what do we got? Corinth, you need stuff building. Can we get stables? Might use a lot of cavalry, I'm not gonna lie. Rose probably more useful. Shipwright wouldn't go on this. Oh god, we, we, need, we need sewers in Sparta. It's it's way too big to not have sewers at this stage. <laughs> Like Anassa still doesn't have enough money, or people rather. Uh, we've got enough going on in loads. Okay. Sam's got stuff, Syracuse's got stuff. 
Oh, you've got four families to inform now. I mean... Uh, the, uh, do we do we bother? Like they're already they're already traitors to like Rome. So would we really sending like letters back to their families? So next turn I'm gonna send the troops over to Lily Byam because there's really nothing there to be worried about and. Uh, now taken out the only thing that was that could have possibly threatened us. I know it's one unit of Velites, but it's always I always feel a little bit off just leaving an enemy there. Let's see what we've got. The town's growing. Thurman. Uh, well, it's perfect timing because. Uh, I, so now, are you sure you quick. don't want to just let Our me buy? Our patience is limited. You insult us. Well, I tried. Orders? Yes, Stratigos. Attack! Orders? People are really not happy. Uh, set the tax rate a little bit lower. Okay, quite a lot lower. Now everyone's happy. I am losing money. So best solve this pretty quickly. Action announcements. Uh, oh, the Julii are finally at war with Gaul. Good job, Julie. I nailed it. Uh, Armored hot plates, pillars. What the hell going on? That's fine. Germans got stuff building. Athens needs things. Uh, get a shipwright going on. Donia. Get some roads. Like, you, you don't really need roads around. On these islands, but like, it does it does still give benefits to taxes or so uh, of trade rather. That's yeah, Hans is just hanging around. Oh, that Pontus has taken. Yeah, the has taken Sardis. That's interesting. Guy is still desperately trying to uh, to blockade us, uh, and yeah, clearly it's working from all the money that I haven't got. Oh wait, no. Everyone hates school. What an update! So much money, so much money. Ah. Oh. Brutti, I. They're doing their best. Ready. How many, how many ships have they got there? Three. Ready. Yeah, yeah they should. These guys Ready should be able to take them out. Bye, Admiral we Marcus. Are yes, sir. Can we? Uh, let's stop. I need something constructing here. Uh, get a ship right and can retrain these guys. Raise the rice then. We haven't got any rice. We need to we need to contact Uncle Ben. You're like, it's an emergency. We don't have rice to tax. Like, 
I told you never to call here again. And we might, yeah, I know, but like, emergency. Now, it's no, the the uh, the spy is not going to open the door. Shame. Oh well. Settlement under siege, siege, sir. because I'm a little bit worried of how isolated it is. Probably get people over there from roads if we needed to, but it's not like roads has a lot of truth. Never got to see us take Sicily. Rest in rest in peace, Cleomenes. Cleomenes? Cleo. Rest in peace, Cleo. Larissa has grown. <laughs> Was this shock of Larissa growing? What killed? Him? Like he had a heart attack. F, F in the chat for Cleo. New faction leader, Memnon of Sparta. Oh, and Eugenius got married. How nice for him. Overall, it's a good month. Uh, apart from, you know, Cleo dying. Sparta retrained all that. That's good. Corinth needs something to build. Thank you. Thank you for the S. Okay. A couple of things there. Cadonia. Land clearance and trader. There's no point building a barracks there just yet. It's not like it's about to be attacked. Like it, it, it was, it was rebel for like how how many turns? Like twenty five turns. <laughs> mm. All right. Imperator. So, if I uh, if I'm right. By the time we're done with this, we should be almost done with the stream. So the uh, the last fight is uh, it's Lily Byam, which I mean is is obvious when you think that the uh, the story is about you know child murder and organ harvesting. I'll never get over that. Let's hear what wonderful things the dulcet tones of the Roman traitor fellow, who's now Greek, has to say. Oh, I wonder what inspiring things he has to say. Those overly proud men over there are the Carthaginians. They think they are our equals, our enemies. I think they are waiting to die. And draw strength from this fact. The enemy are so loathed that no ally can be found to support them. They think their walls are enough to stop us. They should think again. 
Our numbers are vastly superior. It may not seem fair, but we are not here to be fair, only to win. They are strong in cavalry, but to what end? We have many spearmen, and this will counter that threat handily. I fought these people before, and now I thirst for revenge. Today we shall slake our thirst for blood. Today is victory day! When I set my heart on an attack, I do so knowing that I will win, that my men will win, that victory is within reach. All we need to do is stretch out and grasp the foe firmly by the throat. There have been many portents, both good and bad. With such confusion in the heavens, it is up to us to forge our own destiny. I want to see blood. I want to bathe in their blood. I want to bathe in their blood for a week. Now, kill them all! Cool. He seems like a perfectly reasonable human being. Yeah, we don't we don't want Peltas to the rounds. Oh, you are also on no. say we're in good position now. Oh, I would have liked some archers to be honest, but oh well. Ram! Ramming position! Ram! But the 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 doors the gates are open. What? <laughs> I mean don't get me wrong, I don't just want to walk position. through because they they will just bottleneck me. But I, I guess we can just leave this ram here. Abandon the ram! Hoplites elite! Hoplites! Quickly! Orders completed, Commander! I think he's firing with a. Well, I know I had it on fast forward, but again, that thing was, was going like a machine gun. Our soldiers are Now they must battle their way gun. through. Hoplites! Form a phalanx! Waiting for orders! Hurry! Orders completed, Commander! I can't believe that Lily Biome still only has a wooden wall. Like, you'd think they'd have upgraded by now. Come on, Calvage, what are you doing? You're trying to take Masana, that's what you're doing, and then just bought it back off you. Which I guess is a pretty good scam, but like... Maybe you should have spent some time, you know, on this. I didn't give you money, actually. I gave you know, that, that one guy money. The gods have smiled on us today. The walls are broken. Our troops should be ordered forward. We're being attacked! Ram! Hoplites! Form a phalanx! 
sublight! Form a phalanx! Doesn't really matter if this formation is a little bit loose, because it's only going after skirmishers and they're not even looking in the right direction. Skirmishes, and yeah, not much to worry about there. And more infantry. Yeah, nothing really threatening. Only thing I need to, really need to bother with is the general's bodyguard. Seem too much. I'm like leaving them vulnerable. Well, this day, the walls are taken. Hurry! Run! Up lights. Quickly! Let's get these skirmishers in. units there and I'm gonna bring in the uh some of the heavies. Oh looks like we're getting some visitors. These guys, no, no. Yeah, it really looks like the uh, even damage these guys are holding against the uh, against the Iberians. So. Not too much of a worry there. Deal, mind you, the skirmishes rushing out. This, uh, no, what am I talking about? The skirmishes. Who cares? <laughs> no, run at them. Hit them. It won't matter. Why 
fighting for orders. Skirmishers! Destroy them! Bertha! Make ready now! Make ready! Make ready! <laughs> These guys are uh, not winning. Oh no, oh no guys, crashing all at once is not the solution here. going on with the audio where sound effects are just not stopping which is interesting to them again. Oh, this is like cavalry versus a phalanx. Let's see how this goes. Oh, about as well as you'd expect. This is our chat. Oh no. <laughs> that just ran away just at the sight of them. Which to me makes sense because why, why would you win? Why, why would you actually charge at this? they do they're not gonna beat spearmen especially not light cavalry heavy cavalry maybe can tank like if they're if it's already an injured unit it could go, probably go, go. probably survive a little bit but like a single hit point like light cavalry with no armor yeah that thing's going down okay. Ooh. speaking of Looks like the general got bored of waiting and he's charging it. The 
gods be praised! Oh. The enemy general is dead! His men know their doom approaches! There goes, uh, I'm pretty sure that's even the enemy, like the enemy leader. If I remember correctly. Oh, they just have their leader in Lily Byam for some Mo, reason. Mo. Mo, Mo, run. They keep on trying to charge and just rout him because there's just nothing left. Oh, actually, this could be bad. We don't, we don't want this. Kind of do just want to take this guy out, though. So might be worth just holding on. Yep, there we go. Yes, while they're routing, I don't think they can do damage, but I do think they'll still take damage from the spears. Yep. They are breaking the formation a bit, though, which is not ideal. Ah, well, still, uh, still getting just destroyed. That was just sad to watch. That was just ritualistic suicide. That was wasn't even a fight. They just ran and threw themselves on the pipes. I hope they've decided against it. They were going to charge straight into the spears, but then went, oh wait, didn't we try this before? for you. Oh, they're out, they're out of missiles. Uh, you know what? Probably better to just pull back then, actually. i send in the uh, regular pelt tests. How am I supposed to raise the rice tax when they don't even have faces anymore? Right guys, that's not how a phalanx works. <laughs> Just gonna tell you. There we go. That's better. <laughs> There's just a carpet of dead bodies here. Alexander got to like India and he went, well, no more worlds to conquer. What else could there be? 
What do you mean, Mongolian Empire? I oh, don't know what you're talking about. Slightly different heroes. This is a victory way, fit for the gods. My point. A day of triumph to mark with a song or two. So we lost 200 men, but took out 500. I'd say that's, that's pretty good overall. We get some good healing as well, which is nice. Lucy is Scipio. <laughs> See, the Skippy I did end up fighting Carthage eventually. Just not under their own banner. Or by their own will. Um gets a runner and an exotic slave. Whatever you want, Lucy's. Dave on the loading screen. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty bang on. I can't believe they managed to get him into total. I also can't believe that Dave was born in uh, in 258 BC. So, I'd say we've been fairly successful. We've got most of Greece, like, like the important bits of Greece, like the bits with all the uh, the world wonders. Uh, we've, got, we've got all of Sicily, which I thought we were going to lose in the first couple of turns, so really, we'll, we'll turn that one around. Uh, it... Uh, Dave is immortal. You, you're not wrong. We, we have 11 minutes left of the stream. This is, just, this is just chill time, I think. Oh, I am very uncomfortable. I'll tell you that much. 12 hours is a long time. It was a uh, definite, definitely set myself a challenge there. I didn't start 11 minutes late, but the stream went down and I took breaks, so I'm uh, just just gonna see out the last, you know, few minutes. Just just so I can say it was a full 12 hours. It's uh, t it is uh, <laughs> I have, I've run out of words. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I am beat. I can't believe that I managed to keep my brain working this long. Uh, I can't believe I only needed two bathroom breaks. That's, uh... Trust me, that's, imp that's impressive for me. Uh, if, I, if I include it in the 12 hours, then like, I, could, uh, I could abuse it, so I decided that it wouldn't be included just because you know, I, I I want this to be something I, I achieved with a bit of pride. And it, I don't want it like an asterisk next to it of like, yeah, but I did take 15 minutes out for just sitting around for doing other stuff. The charity total so far, I believe is 310 unless it's been updated in the last couple of minutes. Yep, we're at 310 pounds, which is more than three times my original goal. Um, so it's it's kind of uh, it's kind of an insane amount, and then I don't whatever else comes in because uh, the donations don't close until I want to say the end of Friday, if I remember correctly. So it like the, if people haven't had time, then there's you know there's. There's a bit of breathing room for, for people to to submit it and so on. Uh, it, I, like honestly, when I I think you were there, Bernard, when I first like 
said, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm considering doing a, a charity stream. And then we were just discussing what we, I would play and so on. And boy, is it, <laughs> did it escalate. Because damn, I, uh, I did not expect this to be as much of a challenge or catch on nearly as much. When I set that £100 goal, I thought I was being, like, reasonable. And then it's, it's turned into far more, so... <laughs> he hasn't signed in the Blood of Kings. Well, I do, uh... I do live with uh, a guy who claims to be the descendant of Oliver Cromwell, so if that's the case, it's probably probably gonna just off me at some point. You know, a bit of a laugh. I'm just saying, if you find me being like decapitated, it was Ben. That's what happened. I, I, I genuinely just get, like cannot believe it's done. It's it, it's been something on my mind for like the last month. It's been crazy. Um, uh, don't let him take you to Huntington. I will not. I don't think he could. But uh, God. I'm just, I'm just looking at the, the Facebook page and seeing what came in during the stream because I really didn't get much of a chance. I kind of wanted it to be just 12 hours bell to bell, but I... Uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, how warm is it in there? I am dying. <laughs> it's so hot in here. Oh. Also, also, just don't go to Huntington. Also, yeah, also a good point. Just don't go there. There's no, there's no, there's no benefit. So, uh, instead, just, just sit, or just, just go and everywhere but Huntington. I mean, you know. Oh no! I, I went to Edge Hill University. Oh god. <laughs> oh no! We're all, I'm, I'm doomed. I'm gonna have to. Gonna have to start reaching. There's a cro don't don't put that thought out into the universe, Bernard, because I'm fairly certain that like Ben will find a way to get himself in there. It's grease themed temperatures. It really is. It genuinely is. You can like I'm wearing a white t-shirt. That was a bad idea. Because it's now grey <laughs> just from the sweat. It's just soaked through. Oh, I am. Um, when the stream is done, I am putting my feet up and probably ordering some food in because I am not cooking. <laughs> what about a word from our, our sponsors, Raid Shadow Legends? <laughs> yeah, you know you can uh, you can you can get it now on uh, on Android and iOS. It's it's a a full RPG, you know, has quests and story and uh, party members. And uh, and the people we pay say that they can't believe it's a mobile game. It's crazy. So, NordVPN. Uh, I, I've got nothing for NordVPN. <laughs> yeah, I tell you, those those Audible audiobooks, specifically Audible ones. And uh, and Raycon headphones. Uh, they they I like to, I like to listen to them where I, while I'm wearing me undies. Uh, and and uh, and and uh, and saving money using the the Honey browser extension. <laughs> uh, yeah, what else? What else is there? Um, if if I'd have thought about it, I'd have I'd have advertised the stream on a website made in Squarespace. <laughs> it's the four horsemen of advertising. 
Yeah. Get his food from HelloFresh. Yeah. So uh, sign up now and you can get a discount code. And talk about Manscaped. You do not want to advertise for HelloFresh food and Manscaped on the same stream. No matter how you look at it, one of these is not going to be enjoyable. Helmet 69. Then you'll find it's uh, Weed Goblin 69420. My back is actually killing me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to just stare at the sky, and just lay down for like the next 27 hours. Ah, uh, the devil's lettuce, you know, the the jazz cabbage. There it is. Yeah. <laughs> The reefer. Uh, I, I feel like we're getting into a different sort of advertising here. I think we're. Uh, I think we're looking for a very specific clientele, and that clientele is just Liam, who I don't even <laughs> think is uh, is still watching. But uh, shout out to Liam, I guess. I got nothing. <laughs> crate. Oh god, can you imagine Rome Total War with loot crate? <laughs> Open this and you can get an incendiary pig. Literally bringing home the bacon. It's that time. Oh, I, I am done. Thank you guys for sticking around and and watching this through with me. I I said at the start of the stream, really, I was I was just sort of making sure that I streamed it as proof that I did do it. Um, so it's it's there for all to see. But I I, I appreciate how much fun it's been and all you guys sticking around and making jokes and keeping this entertaining and hopefully I gave a little bit of a, of, a, of an evening or a, or a day so I'm gonna I'm gonna go lay down and just not think about video games for like hours but I uh, I'll, I'll uh, put a proper thank you up on on Facebook when I'm functional in the meantime, I will see you guys later. Have a have a good evening.